Okay, looks like it's good. Welcome, everybody. Welcome. Yep, it's actually recording this time. We're all set up, ready to have some fun times. And I immediately just want to duel already. Oh, they're blocking the entrance there. You know what? Let's duel these two. Let's get started. Tag duel? Why not? We're playing a double Cyber Dragon deck with uh, Cyrus now. We were able to edit his deck last time, and it was going uh, going great. First to go, second to go. All set up. A hack like that might require a little bit of effort, but I would love it if someone could just hack the main character to look like my VTuber or something. That would be amazing. That'd be the kind of mod I'd commission someone for, yeah. Hang on. Just the volume a tad. How's it sound for you guys? We all set up? We just switched from Banjo, so now we're having a good time with this. He's going Future Fusion. Oh no, he's going to... He, Chad, he's going to do it. Is he really going to do it? Oh, no. No way. Turn one, baby. Let's go. W what a start. What a start. Okay, then. Welcome to Yu-Gi-Oh, everybody. It's our first duel of the day. And Cyrus just decided he wants to fuse 20 monsters into Chimera Tech Overdragon. Is he gonna FTK with this? How much is it? Oh my god, he... Oh my, oh my, oh my... Oh my goodness. We can never make fun of, uh... Cyrus's, uh... We can never make fun of Cyrus again after that. Cool. Now that's a clip, everybody. <laughs> now that's a clip. Just casually fuse half your deck into a giant monster and win on the first turn. I I didn't even get to play. That was all him. That was all him. Oh, I got a big stupid smile on my face. What's the high score? Shortest... <laughs> Oh, that's great. That's great. Amazing start. Doe, you beat me, but I'm almost happy you did. Yeah, we did it. Uh, let, let's let's do it again. How about we, yeah, how about we do another one? I told you all it would happen eventually. I didn't expect it to happen uh, as soon as we started this episode, though. Just gonna go wash your dishes. You've seen everything. Yeah. May as well stop watching the rest of the series. I don't think anything's gonna top that. That was that was just great. He can't do it again though. He doesn't have the pieces. Still, that would have been pretty darn cool. Okay, he's going lightning blade. This is like when we played Mario Party the other day and there was a bunch of hidden blocks on the first turn, but somehow this was way more chaotic. He doesn't have Overload Fusion on him. Hmm. Am I really gonna Heavy Storm this? Hmm. I could just Future Fuse a good monster, though. Hmm. Do I want to get rid of the Lightning Blade? <laughs> I'm, I'm being a little picky right now, I know. Whatever, let's do this. I don't have Overload Fusion, so it wouldn't be very smart of me to do that, but I'm gonna do this. One, two, three. Okay. And now I'll just defend with this for a second. I'm not gonna waste limiter removal killing it, even if I could. Not gonna waste the Heavy Storm yet either. Fusion Gate. Cyrus will skip his draw phase. Hmm. So I'll do this. Well, I'll skip mine too, but you know. Okay, that's good. If I could get Jinzo on the field, that's even better. Jinzo and Cyber End is great. Wait, what? Oh, he's making Ojama Knight. Well then. Damage step. No, no, no. Don't gonna worry about that. Cyrus, go ahead and defend for us. I know you can do it. There, see? He's got his swords... Never mind. <laughs> Oops. This is fine, though, because watch what will happen on my turn. My turn is going to be an absolute slaughter. 
Oh. Watch. Just watch, chat. It won't be as impressive as Cyrus, what he did last time, but still, it'll be cool. Ah, darn it. He had the attacks now. That's fine. Never mind. Disregard everything I said, because I can't play now. I can't put Jinzo down. I mean, I could, but we have Cyber End, so why would we? Limiter removal, not gonna... Wait. I could Limiter removal, attack Jax Knight for game. Or Limiter removal, attack uh, Ojama. <laughs> yeah, I could. Why not? Why, why shouldn't we? Go to the battle phase. Casually attack Ojama Black there. Hit him for 7,000, and we win. Future Fusion is a fun, fun mechanic. Isn't that nice? I think it's pretty nice. Yo, oh, you beat me. I'm not going to be able to top, like, top Cyrus's play today. That was, that was absurd. Man put down, like, the turn one. That, you know what that was? That was an anime duel. You know how, like, they have those duels in the anime? Or to show off how powerful a character is and they just win right away like that. That's what Cyrus just pulled off. You can stack limiter removals, yeah, but it's limited to one, so I have to use Cyrus's and my own, assuming he sets it on his turn or something. That's the reason the card is limited, because you could just play three of them and just, like, attack per game with a very stupid strategy. Oh, chat, he going for it. He's going for it again, but he doesn't have Overload Fusion. Okay. This soldier. He's going to go for the attack. He's going to use the cylinder up. This is actually going to be good. If I could get Overload, that would be amazing. But no problem here. So this thing's got 2,300... Can just go ahead and bring back Jinzo for the turn. That would be easy. Actually, what I could do. No, that won't work, because King of the How King of the Swamp works. We're going to lose our card in a second here. That's okay. Where's Jinzo? Jinzo, Jinzo. Just to beat over the soldier this turn. No point in setting any cards. Actually, I could have put something down for an extra attack. That was a bit silly of me. That's okay. We're getting our brain warmed up here. Mm. No, there's no point. The future fusion chimera tech will just obliterate everything. When it comes on the field, and we'll be wide open. That's the problem. <laughs> It'll destroy its own future fusion and our, our other cards. But an extra monster in the graveyard would mean that we have an extra thing for... <laughs> that we have an extra thing for Overload Fusion. That's what I'm thinking now. Twister. Oh, no! Well, wait. Oh, my God. That's actually the best thing he could have possibly did for me. I I'm not going to lose Jinzo anymore. Oh, no! Oh no, chat! Oh nice, he topped uh, Ollie there. Sick. Wait, what? Oh, he's making Chimera Tech instead. All right, sure. I thought he was gonna make Cyber Twin. Fair enough, I guess. Is he bringing back? Oh, chat! Like I, t Cyrus is actually doing pretty damn good. Like we gotta give this man some credit. Look at him go. And now we got this. No point uh, making my own Chimera Tech with that now, I feel. I will activate this effect, though, to s discard him. When will he fail? Not today. I'm going to put this down in attack mode, and I'm going to put this down to bait it, because why not? It'd be funny. Can't attack because of his swords are revealing light. Once I gave him a real deck, he's got the brain cells to play. Oh, wait, what am I saying? I can't use my own trap card because Jinzo. Oops. <laughs> I forgot about that for some reason. Silly me. 
I ended up just wasting the gyroid for no reason. No problem now. Ceasefire, won't be able to use that. Infuse to another Chimera attack, but what's the point? No point putting you down. I made the I made the small brain plays now. Isn't that fun? Okay. For now, we'll just pop his monsters. Take out the duck. Take out that. He fused three monsters here, so... Okay, good, he's out. Nice. He's got a king of the swamp. Is he really gonna... Please don't. Please tell me you're not gonna do something. Okay, good. I thought he was gonna do something real silly for a second. I wish he would have made Cyber Twin instead, but no. He's always gonna prioritize Chimera Tech over Dragon most of the time. <sighs> Won't be enough to kill. That's fine. We got him on the ropes. They can't even use their trap cards. Well, they haven't been set in any, so it doesn't matter. Go, go, go. Sometimes when I start playing with Jinzo... Oh, he got chat. Oh, he had overload, but he's not going to use it. Damn. That's fine. Um, Sometimes when I keep start playing Jinzo again, my brain forgets that Jinzo affects me <laughs> and not just the opponent's. Because half the time I have Jinzo, I don't even have my trap cards anymore. Good XP on that. We'll take it. You're pretty good. What a great duel. Cyrus, I remember him doing some silly stuff last time, but he's doing pretty good right now, I gotta say. Maybe he just had some bad draws? Flying fairies. Let's try you. I've lost to you a few times, and we're on a good streak. Once we fixed his deck, he got a brain cell to play with. Yes, he did. First to go, second to go. Nice. Tag duel. The Cyberoids. Everything gotta be changed to partner's deck once you edit it. I don't remember if you're allowed to actually change the name of the deck after you edit. Can you? It doesn't matter. Get Sakuretsu'd. Okay, now I could make Chimera Tech right now with all that. Couldn't I? Couldn't I? No, wrong button. Am I really gonna throw away my whole hand on one monster like that? Of course I am. If it doesn't work, it'll be stupid, but if it does, it'll be funny. This is what we in the biz call the funny. 4,000. Hang on a second. This might work. If that if that back row card doesn't interrupt me. <gasps> it will. Yes. Yes! <laughs> Perfect. Now that's nice. Eight twenty on that one. Oh, I lost. You shine so brightly, I hardly knew what hit me. Look forward to our next battle. Yeah, we did it. Good dueling right now. Good dueling. There's Jesse and Hyde with super strength. Why not? I think we can take him out. I'll go first. My brain keeps trying to press the, 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 the Nintendo layout for the controller again. But we switched to PlayStation. I keep pressing, like, the uh, circle button. Because I'm used to that being where the A button is on Nintendo controllers. Playing Banjo for almost four hours before this really affected me. Unshrimp? Don't mind if I do. I will stretch a teensy tiny bit. Okay, he's going for that. Sakuretsu armor. 
No draw on that, though, sadly. That's okay. I could activate Overload Fusion, but there's only two cards we get out of that. Hmm. Unless... Hmm, I could just go for a Power Bond. Hang on. From your hand or your side of the field, the graveyard. Do that there. Yeah, that could be okay. And then use Overload out of that, but that would just make- that would break Chimera Attack, yeah. That wouldn't work. You can only keep one. Hmm... Do I go for it? Of course I will. Of course I will. I'm gonna go for it. I'm going all in again. Okay. One, two, three. Power Bond will double its attack. 4,800. There we go. And I missed my window to activate it. It's okay. It's okay. It was just a misclick because Nintendo layout. But it's okay now. Can't make a second one because it will just pop it. But we can still do enough damage as it is right now. Alright, attack this. Okay, good. Nothing got flipped up. Damn it, could have OTK'd him, but I accidentally hit the wrong button on the prompt for the limited removal. I take a teeny bit of damage, but who cares? Rainbow... Yeah, ruins. I almost said Rainbow Cemetery. That's not right. Well, Cyrus, you can easily win this game. Come on. Oh, never mind. End phase. We got Mirror Force anyway. Well, I, I can do this. Hang on. I'll discard King of the Swamp so it's an extra body in the graveyard. And then I'll activate Overload Fusion to fuse everything in the graveyard and attack for game. See? Backup plan. We got it. No! Okay, I have to hit them individually. So, so, I, sorry. The way it orders the fusion menus confuses me sometimes. I feel like I accidentally close it by mistake. But it's actually just asking for the named monster in front first. 4,000. Not bad. See? First turn OTK. Absolutely nothing was misclicked. What are you talking about? Nothing, chat. 794. Nice. We're on a win streak. We're doing pretty good right now. I wonder if win streaks affect how much the hearts can go up. The fried shrimp here is the best, isn't it? Nice. Limited fun. Mushroom man. Eh, you know what? We haven't fought Kenyu in a good while. I wonder how many new students the uh, Tag Force 3 adds. We should be seeing a lot more characters, though, in the, the 5Ds games. Okay, first to go, second to go. Everyone get comfy. Everyone get cozy. Cyberoids. We're, re we're around the corner from finishing Cyrus's um, events today. I think we can definitely finish his playthrough, I feel. We're going to play this for like three or so hours, I think. It'll be nice. It'll be cozy. Not sleeping the best again, but that's okay. Okay. Well, I've got all these. They're going to be useless to me anyway, so I could just... Do I really need to Heavy Storm or save them as a backup if Jinzo dies? Jinzo will stop their back row anyway, so it's not like I need it. I'll just give Jinzo Mage Power. That's what I'll do. That'll certainly shut him down. Do I want to put one more down? Eh, not necessary, I feel. So let's just go into the battle phase and attack. Mushroom Man. Maybe we do need limiter removal for that. You know, we could... Maybe next turn go for the kill if we have the bodies. Oh, you son of a... Well, now I got a heavy storm next time. This is bad. This is really bad. This is super duper bad.
Ooh. Please do something, Cyrus. Special summon Cyber Dragon. Good. Premature Burial. He's gonna take out Reflect Bounder. Is he going for it? Okay, he's gonna beat over that thing. He's challenging Jinzo to attack us. This is okay, actually. Yeah. Okay. Uh, sure. I'll have a destiny draw. Take my Swords of Revealing Light. Hmm. No, I'll just Heavy Storm. It's probably for the best to do that. And now we are set to kill for game. Mamma mia. That spicy damage we're about to pull off, everybody. Oops, I meant to attack with Cyber Dragon first, but oh well. You can't stop Jinzo. He's too spooky. The King of Armored Necks. Okay, not bad. I lost. Yeah, we did it. Let's keep it up. Okay. Not too bad at all. Not too bad at all. By the way, chat, if you've been missing it, we have been doing a lot of Yu-Gi-Oh! this past week now. Hmm, voice crack. We started the Falsebound Kingdom randomizer, and that's been going very well. I'm glad people seem to like that one so much. Um, you know what? How about you two? Why not? Do that. And we also met the goal for Reshuff Destruction, so I'm going to be starting that one sometime soon. I'm not sure of my schedule for the week at all, to be honest, because we have multiple games we got to do. I also need to get some video stuff done, but I've just had no time. Perfect. Can you believe it? So much comfy Yu-Gi-Oh stuff is going to happen. I can hardly believe it. Card games on this channel? Who saw that coming? Okay, he's going for Luster Dragon. It's going to pop over us, but it's not a big deal. Hmm. Yeah, that won't work. We'll go ahead and special summon you. don't really need the Call of the Haunted. Do I want to pop that one card? E yes, I do, honestly. Wait, did he also had a Call of the Haunted. Okay, that was probably a good, good, good decision, I'd say. And I'm going to put my whole hand down and put this on Cyber Dragon, because screw him. Do this, do that. All right. Phase is now ended. He's got... Oh, no, he's got Swords of Revealing Light. Do I want to pay the life points to stop that? I'm not sure I do. Hmm. Nah. I don't need a Reckless Greed until it's my turn now. Rock Bombardment. Yeah, whatever. Oh, Cyrus, that's mine, you little brat. That's mine, you little frickin' brat. Why'd you use that? What is your problem? He's got the stick. No, what are you doing? All right, fine, whatever. There goes my cards. <laughs> he got rid of everything. Oh, look what happened. Good job, Cyrus. Oh. I knew that was going to happen as soon as he started doing all that. Oh. <laughs> no, this is Cyrus's fault, not mine. He used my reckless greed, too. Take back everything he said. He ruined it. Ruined it. He threw it. He threw it so hard for me. He was doing so well, too. He broke the win streak. And now we get Goggle Golemed. Oh, Cyrus. 
That's fine, though. That's fine. Aha, piece of cake. Aw, oh, man, we lost. We lost, but we're not done yet. What about you two? Bought them enough times. What about you? Burning flame. Bear strength. Why not? We need a 10th victory against her. Now he didn't break the game. He didn't break the game at all. He's just like, he threw all his cards into that one thing and it got destroyed by a flip effect. Dante and his burning flame. He opened with Snatch Deal, okay. He threw down his Submarine Roid. The A-Forces. Command Knight. Yeah, that's fair enough. We wouldn't have been able to beat over us, but still. Ooh, now this is what, what we want to see. Let's Heavy Storm. Now this is Submarine Roid. In here, we got a whole lot of nothing. Hmm. Don't really need to bring back Submarine Roid. Best we just do this. Okay, 800 will be 29, then we 800, we do that. Okay, that won't be enough, though. So there's no point you just bringing it back with Premature Burial at all. We'll go ahead and just attack with Cyber Dragon, though. It's okay. End turn. We're farming them sick points. No, don't need to do that. Blazing and Pachi. Yes, actually, I am going to do something about you. I might take damage, but who cares? He's getting bodied, man. He's great. Is he going to make... Please make Cyber End. I'm begging you. Don't do... Thank goodness. I thought he was going to make them into Chimera Tech. No! Well, at least he had a backup plan. Okay, he's not attacking. They know they can't do it. 2100. Well, if that's the case, we'll just do this then. Yes, we can bring it back from the dead. Now then. That's right, you don't got another one, girl. I love just casually bringing Cyber End back from the grave. I love doing that. What a stupid, strong monster. Oh, shoot, you beat me. Take it easy, will ya? Let's duel again. Was that very fun? All those gains, and we've barely gotten, like, half a heart on that. Damn. All right, let's duel you two again. You're still here, so why not? Yeah, widespread ruin sure does ruin my day. For sure. Okay, first to go, second to go. We're a little bit away from some more cutscenes, but it's okay. Everything is gonna be happy and wholesome and just fine. Mm, okay. That's my opening hand, but I don't get to act yet. He's throwing away King of the Swamp. Is he immediately gonna make Chimera Tech? No, he is not. Chainsaw Insect. Can't beat over it. Yeah, I feel like giving... After his FTK at the start of the episode, he should have absolutely just freaking... Um, oh, hang on. I can just MST that. It absolutely should have just, like, maxed out his hearts on principle. Because that was amazing. All right. Do I want to use Proto Cyber Dragon for this? I could just, like, call this and make Chimera Tech now, but the problem is it, it wouldn't be safe. There's two face downs. I don't trust that at all. I'm going to set this. Hmm. And I'm going to thin my deck a tiny bit with this one, too. Don't think I need to really use United We Stand yet. 
trying to play it safe for a second. Never mind. Battle phase has been skipped, everybody. Well then. We got money for sandwiches. We sure as hell do now. Um. Nah. Just let the submarine die. I don't need to max them out and kill them both. Come on, Cyrus. I believe in you. You can do this. Yes. Yes. Make Cyber Twin. Make Cyber Twin. Make Cyber Twin. Damn it. He's making Chimera Attack. Will he activate his limiter removal? No, he's not going to flip it. He's going to let it go. Honestly, better decision since he can't win with this move anyway. Still, it's funny. Warrior returning alive. Warrior of Zera. Uh. What'd that say? Eki Boyo. Re let me read it, please. Let me read it. A monster equipped with this card cannot attack at the end of the mo equipped monster's controller's second turn after this card is activated. W what is that sentence? At the end of the equipped monster's controller's second turn after this card is activated. Destroy the equipped monster. At that time, this card is returned to the owner's hands. Your, your monster's second cousin's controller card owner on a Tuesday. <laughs> Isn't what it <laughs> reads like at first. All right. Well, that's a pain. It can't attack. It's going to get destroyed. Mm. Can't power bond anything. I may as well united we stand the, the train for now or something. Ah, that might be a bit of a waste. I could set it for now because... <sighs> Another threatening roar. Yeah, I guess it's a good thing I didn't then. All right, we'll leave it. It's an old, old card. I can tell. sanctuary in the sky man eater bug is he just gonna pop the yeah he is gonna waste it on the one here was already gonna pop and now we go down a little bit sadly guess i should have gave it the united we stand after all but if i did that it would have just become the new target for man eater bug more than likely oh hang on chad he's got to come back let him cook let him cook chat Yeah. Yeah. No battle damage because of Sanctuary in the Sky and Shining Angel's a fairy. Unfortunately for you, we're about to win. The top deck of Overload Fusion is so stupid. I hate how we can just get away with this so easily. Now I may as well use my normal summon I couldn't use earlier. Time to end, though. Dude, Overload Fusion leads to some really funny moments. It's super risky, though, letting the AI use stuff like this, but when it works, it freaking works. Uh oh Well, that didn't work. At least he had swords. <laughs> and you're gone. We just kind of hit him once. I've already used my Overload Fusion. Let's go ahead and do this. Just in case it becomes relevant. Swords will stall for us. Yeah, they're building their stuff up. Please use Premature Burial and just put your Chaser down and win. Please, Cyrus, please. Okay, he's bringing that out. He's putting the chaser down. Please attack for game. Please attack for game. No. Well, we lost future fusion, but... Oh, right. No bat... No battle damage on fairy monsters because of Sanctuary. They're really going to hang on to the last bitter moment, aren't they? Oh, they, they goddamn are. Hmm... Using them is not going to do me any damn good. We can't beat over the Marshmallow. I'm going to have to thin my deck a little bit by activating this. I need the draw into, like, Overload Fusion, or... Wait, no, I can't... I can't make Cyber End anymore. I need... I need some kind of out for this. Like, uh, the Drilloid. That's what I need. Yeah. 
Next player's turn. Everything is good. End phase. Okay, the steel cage is gone. Yeah. Well, I don't have anything except this backup plan now. We can't destroy either of those two monsters. Using them isn't going to do anything. It's just going to make a weaker over uh, overtech. Will I make a mill deck again? Probably some point. That was like the Skull Invitation deck. Oh, nice. There's Jinzo. Put this down over Chaser. Do this. Battle of one sick to papa. Fortunately, this is all we can freaking do. We game the cocoon, but it doesn't matter. Come on, Cyrus. Oh man. This game slowed down real bad. Another nightmare. Oh boy. Well, can't attack because of the because of the nightmare steel cage. Okay, what's he doing? Please don't fuse them all. No! What are you doing? <laughs> That isn't gonna do us any good. He's putting that down. Oh, there, well, there's this. All right, then. Now, if I premature burial... Yeah, Jinzo would be the best bet right there. Hmm. Oh, wait, I can bring back Drilloid now. That would probably be better, actually, because we need that to finally start cooking this damn, this damn guy here. Yay. You need to get rid of the Marshmallow. Because you're the only one that can do it. Now, let's see, let you use all your attacks to destroy as much as you can. We won't be able to destroy that little fairy, though. Yeah, this thing can't be destroyed, right? I'll attack it again. Just because I can, and I'm spiteful. Another sanctuary, you piece of trash. Please. 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 Yeah, there we go. This should have ended like 20 turns ago, and then we entered Stall City. <laughs> that was ridiculous. What happened? 949. At least we got a lot of points for that. Not bad. Probably because of how long it went on. Yeah, we farmed a ton of points because of how good Cyrus was for this. Yeah. All right, let's go to class. Get some. See if we can get a little further in the dungeon because we're in the much lower levels. About to beat my high score. Deck at it. Let me just go ahead and take out my good stuff. All right, hope you're all feeling comfy and cozy today, chat. I've been doing pretty good. Load recipe. Okay. I'm gonna take out the hero deck. Yeah, that'll do just fine. Enter the basement. Excellent. Okay. Okay, there's you, there's you two, there's you, there's you two. Yeah, that'll work. Yeah, it doesn't, it, if it resets the dungeon between uh, character playthroughs, that would be such a waste of time. You'd have to go through it over and over. I got exactly what I need out of this one. This will be real easy. Goblin Thief and Tremendous Fire is great. Nice. Make quick work of them to get this here. Pardon me. Ooh. Nose was itchy, but I couldn't speed up. Couldn't speed up at all. 
I'm not sure when a great day for a starting Reshef would actually be. Uh-oh, they're doing this. Okay, then. Now let me attack. Um, yeah, I'm not sure when a great day for starting Reshef would be, because I'm trying to figure out, um... Quite a few different things this week, so I'm a little hesitant to even post a schedule right now. I know the majority of you will not care, but still. Figure I'd just mention that right quick. Okay. Not to mention I'm a bit behind on getting some stuff uploaded. Simply because um, a couple things got copyright claimed. I'm having issues with Mother 3 again. I really just don't want to make uploading that game easy at all. Nice. There we go. You win. But that's YouTube. We all know how it works by now. Damn it, I hit the button. I didn't see what I got. Do it when Tag Force 2 is over. That's going to be that's going to be like months. I'm not going to do that. I promised I'd start it as soon as I can. There we go. Final flame. Um, I guess we should set this one. Assuming he's going to attack, we'll do this. We still have, like, several characters left to play after this, too. Burning land for him. Ashura Priest. Hmm. That goes back to his hand. Okay, I'm gonna take a little bit of burning, la uh, burning land damage, but it's okay. Ojama tokens are cooking, but that's okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and flip summon Desk Koala, and it's gonna hit him for game. I was really hoping he would just attack into me, and it'd be fine. I did not want my Burning Land to cause issue. Okay, nothing from him. Got a ladder. Enemy. That's right, we get access to Dark Arm Dragon next game. We get no silly stuff, though. And, um, hey, what was that? Tornado Wall. Okay. Any damage from attacking monsters becomes zero. Okay, that doesn't matter, then. We'll do this. Okay. Reshef does have an original story, but, uh, it's... It's extremely slow and takes forever simply because of how grindy they made the game. I wonder if when I do that, I should set up, um, I should set up retro achievements for it. So I can just pop achievements as I play it. I haven't actually looked at the achievement list for it, though, so maybe I should, like, research if that's worth doing first. We'll find out. Found a ladder? No problem. Without an enemy, no problem. Okay, we're gonna play Sparks first to bait the negate. 200. Hinotama. 500. I have been level 41 for an eternity. Leveling up in this game after a certain point just, like, takes forever. Okay, if that's the case, what we can do here... I'm gonna get him one way or another, don't worry. Digimon World also, I wanna make time to start soon. The last time I did sub goals, um, hang on a second, okay, there we go. The last time I did sub goals, it took literally a couple months to get to some of them because of uh, some unexpected things, so I promised this time I would get to them as soon as humanly possible. Let's do it. All right, enemy, let's go. Throw down the rhyme, eh? Um, damn it, he's gonna have a little bit left after this anyway, huh? If that's the case, I might as well not bother using Tremendous Fire to burn myself for a little bit of damage. I'll just immediately finish him off with Secret Barrel and, and Just Desserts. Okay, use Secret Barrel first. Okay, good. Chat, what actually is a Reshef? I don't actually know. Is it just a made-up word that that Yu-Gi-Oh! game used for its title? 
Okay, that immediately goes to where I want, so why not? It's just a made-up word, okay. Yu-Gi-Oh! likes to make up a lot of words and titles. If there's a Rechef of Destruction, can I be the, like, the Rechef of, uh, Teddy's? If it's made up, I can say that. It's more like a biblical name, actually, is it? Alright, we're gonna go ahead and do this. Unfortunately... Wait a second. Oh, no, that was... That was Spell Absorption he activated. Damn it! <laughs> well, then, we're in a bit of a... Bit of a pickle with that one, aren't we? Here we go. Can only damage him for a little bit there. At least I got a little extra life points on this. This is fine. Okay, good. Exactly what I needed here. I'll go ahead and end my turn, and then I'll immediately flip up the secret barrels. No, you don't get the destiny draw. I'm the main character. Only I can do that. Computer just activates their cheat mechanic because they're just dirty cheat in chat. Unbelievable. Okay, here comes the enemy. Oof. Indomitable fighter... Lele. Right, that was his name. Bait the negate with this one. Okay. So far, so good. 500 with that. I can do 800 with this one, so we'll just put this down. Deal damage to the opponent. I want to see the Zane cutscenes, finally, but we haven't... This game is so stingy with letting you see new character cutscenes, like, every time. There's a backup plan right here. You have to go through the same generic four events for the first, like, four hearts of the playthrough. Over and over and over, and the roulette is just so annoying. Sometimes it won't have... Sometimes it, you just won't even see gold sandwiches for an eternity. And you'll end up missing the roulette when it rolls them. Hey, this is going fine. I don't want to be here that long. Let me just take this. A little bit of a, a little bit of that right there. Go down. All right, maybe last floor here. Damn, I wanted to leave. All right, fine then. Here, I'll just do this. Get to the end of this path, hit way here, and then we'll leave. Hmm, okay. As long as he doesn't have spo- uh, not spell absorption, soul absorption. That- that's what it was called, right? We're gonna be leaving shortly after this. I don't mind spending the tremendous fire. Play and safe. Oh wait, what am I doing? I could've just put down Wombat and not- and not taken the, uh, 500. Silly me. Well, it's too late now. It's too late, chat. It's too late, but it's fine. Oh, goody. Excellent. You know, I haven't gotten it much chance to read any more of the Yu-Gi-Oh! manga yet. I'm still, like, exactly where I left off, right after the end of the Death T arc. Okay, here's my full heal again, anyway. I'm kind of waiting for some more volumes to arrive in the mail. Let me see... I have, like, the majority of them now, but some of them, like, it, a lot of the later volumes arrived first, which is annoying. Meanwhile, I'm about to get near the end of, like, volume 5 and 6, and I don't have, like, 7, 8, 9 yet. Okay, we'll just put it all down. I have a backup plan in case he does something to stop the foam darts. It's so funny how in, uh, Falsebound Kingdom... All, like, the guns in that game as well have their models straight up replaced with the little, like, neon orange and blue and green colored stuff. Okay, there we go. Perfect. There we go. 
And we got that. The original only goes up to seven. No, no, no. That's what... After volume seven is where it becomes about dual monsters. I think, like, when they published it in English, they separated them into Yu-Gi-Oh!, Yu-Gi-Oh! Duelist, and then Yu-Gi-Oh! Millennium World, but they're all basically, like, the same series, just continuing onward. You're free to go. Class is over, let's go. Oh, new event? At the store? This is different. What do we got? There you are. Sorry to ask all of a sudden. Would you duel me? I found a duelist that uses a dino deck like me. Yeah, me. Having the same deck ought to make a tag team super powerful. Yes, very powerful. So, you ready? Let's stop stalling and get this duel on. Alright then, here we go. I gotta use my burn deck, but I should be okay. First to go, second to go. Easy. All right, start duel. Oh boy, here's my sparks. And I can just at least destroy his field spell with Burning Lands. Cyrus, can you turn one win this, please? It'd be super cool if you could just win this with no effort on our part. Oh, you should have set your Sakuretsus first. Well, too late now. Oh, that's bad. Oh well. That's okay. Fifteen hundred. Well then. Not a whole lot I can do except set this down and pretend it'll work. Hang on a second. What the effect of this is select as an attack target, change defense position. Okay, so attacking into it is stupid. I'm going to put down Burning Land to destroy your field spell anyway. All right, that's not going to deter me. Now it has just a 19 out of 20 there. Okay. Hit it with the Hinatama. Hinatama literally just means fireball, right? In Japanese, I, I guess. I don't know for sure. I could bring back a Mechanical Chaser. We're not going to be able to attack with Slicer anyway, so we may as well just use its effect immediately. Do this. Hmm. I think that's okay. I'll just end my turn on this. Well then, that sucks. Hold, this, hold up a second, chat. Making sure something in the stream's working. Good. 500, look at that. The Dark Triceratops. That's not gonna do a whole lot, sadly. Has it been recording? Oh, don't worry, that's perfectly fine. Special summon Cyber Dragon. Special summon Cyber Dragon and just tribute put Jinzo down. I'm begging you, please. Please. No, don't, 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 don't make Chimera attack. We don't really need... That's not... Mm, okay. At least flip up the Just Desserts first. Well, 100 points stronger. He saw the out. If we would have got Mirror Force, that would have been game right there. And that's game right there. <laughs> Oh, wait, no, we still have a chance. I mean, I kind of want to let him keep... I kind of want to just chat. I really kind of want to let him keep the thing. I'm not going to attack this turn. It's too risky with the back row, so we'll do this. I want to let him keep the Chimera Tech over Dragon, because sometimes he can, he can do really stupid stuff with it. But most of the time, he ends up just, like, wrecking our whole plan. Wrong thing. Inatama is Japanese for fireball. I knew it. Oh, damn. Here we go. Yep, that's game. This is what I get for bringing my crappy deck into this, but they don't give you a chance to change it. So many events happen after class, but they don't give you an opportunity to change your deck. Let's do it again. 
Oh boy. Yeah, a lot of Japanese cards, or sorry, not Japanese cards. A lot of cards, when they're in English, they kind of just have a Japanese name because it makes them sound cooler than they really are. Like, doesn't, like, Hitotsumi Giant literally just mean Cyclops? Like, that would have been boring if they just called the card that, right? But they call him Hitotsumi Giant. It's like, uh... Hitotsumi is, like, literally just, like, one-eyed or something. I don't know. No, you don't understand, friend. You can't change your event on the on the world map. So I mi I'd miss the event if I went somewhere else to change my if I to change my deck. There we go. It means one-eyed. Okay. I have to bring the burn deck into the dungeon because it's good that way. Basically, Cyclops. Raime is also that, right? Like, I know that th that Rai means, like, a uh, thunder in Japanese, doesn't it? Let me see. Well, Yadagarasu is literally, like, uh, a name of, like, uh, a yokai or something, isn't it? Was it a yokai or some other kind of Japanese mythical thing? I don't recall. I'm gonna put this down, and I'm gonna go for the attack with this. Attack directly. Yeah, the three-legged crow yokai. Not gonna use limit removal. Because it won't affect this. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Activate the effect of submarine roid. Okay. Eh, don't need to do that. There's nothing to revive from the graveyard. We'll just end on this. Oh, they have one of these for every moment, do they? Well, if I don't activate this, Cyrus will. Mm. Yeah, attack the koala. See what happens. The koala gets flipped and everything gets bipped. Whatever the hell that means. I'm just spouting random words now. Eh. Come on. Surely you can do this, Cyrus. He's destiny drawing and oh, he he destiny drew the steel. And Sakuretsu. And Bookamoon. Duh. All right then. That's a funky interaction. And he's got Ultimate Tyranno. And he's got Tail Swipe. <laughs> oh, this is bad. This is so bad. Hang on. Maybe we can just out-cheese him here. Hang on a second. Do I have another Slicer in, down in here? No, I don't. That won't work then. I could revive the submarine and go for the attack. Let's see if he, he does anything to stop me. Nope, he's gonna stop me. Odds <sighs> are he could just pop over this anyway. That's the problem. Alright, we'll just have to hope this works out then. End turn. Andrea draws. She's going call the haunted. Bringing back that Gillosaurus. Poison mummy poisons. And this thing only pokes us. The ultimate Tyranno has to be the one that attacks, so we can kind of... Or sorry, it has to be the one that first attacks. We stalled long enough, Cyrus can just... Never mind. Please just set the koala and win. Or attack directly with the sub. Okay. No! Pick a flip effect, you idiot. I put those there for a reason. Is this gonna be... No. Oh my goodness gracious. Come on. Come on. Come on, man. Come on. You're so close. Oh, wait. I win. Take that, jerk. 
just throw a little fire in their face and everybody suddenly doesn't put up a fight anymore. Okay, good. We got it. Asprey, you sure are a strong duelist. Strong. Guess we'll go around and find ourselves an ex-opponent. Look. Hey, Asprey, let's duel again sometime. Um, thank you. Um, I'd really like it if we could duel again. Well, we did it. That's exciting. That's great. All right. Well then, now that we've done all that, I say we go to the actual store and buy some sandwiches. Yes. If you gold sandwich me right away. No. Caviar. No, Cyrus hates that. We got a lot of duel points from all that, though, so it's good. Let's see a card. Ah, tofu. Always the damn tofu. The way to everyone's heart is through their stomach. I mean... Yeah. People like food. Not gonna lie, chat. You know, you if someone just bakes me cookies... I... Well, there we go. Can't help it. I fell in love now. It's over. Normal egg sandwich. All right, then have it. Okay, he liked that too. I was actually going to bake cookies again this uh, this season, chat. It occurred to me that I haven't I didn't do any baking in like the past year. You see. Kind of wanted to do the thing cuz now that I'm going out to the walking trails and doing the gym more, the only, like, sweets I want to eat would just be, like, the stuff I bake myself. There we go. Noodle sandwich? Why not? I baked, like, cookies. Last I baked was, like, cookies a year ago. I think I took pictures and I put them on Twitter. Chat, if I bake more cookies, would you mind if I pause the stream and spend five minutes showing them off? You're goddamn right I'm gonna do that. I'll even, I'll even bring up the VTuber just to do it, too. Make people extra pissed. Excellent. Lettuce sandwich. I still want to get those little cookie cutters to make them look like they're in the shape of a bear. Hmm. And see if I can get some frosting and put them on to make Teddy Ursa cookies. Damn it, I keep getting the tofu. Absolutely. All right, new goals. New year, new me, new cookies. They were chocolate chip last time, and they were okay. Actually, you know what? I get the chance to go to the grocery store tomorrow. Uh, you know what? Uh, tonight, I'm gonna make a list, and I'm gonna I'm gonna get some cookies, or stuff to bake cookies. I can't make the Teddy cookies because I'm too lazy to order cookie cutters right now. I'll make that my goal, everybody. Cyrus, do you like me enough yet? Hurry it up. This takes too damn long. Dried mackerel. Did he like this one? Oh, he actually did. Okay, good. I only really think of cookies when it comes to bacon. I should probably try baking some other stuff, too. Hang on. Oh, wait. It's already full now, isn't it? Top grade salad. Okay, it's full. All right, let me change my deck, because we're going to need to do a story duel coming up next for sure. Um, I did want to make some brownies, because my mom actually made some a few months ago for the holidays, right? Um, she made, like, these really gooey, like, fudge brownies, and she put, like, piece it, like Reese's Pieces on top of them, and they were so good. You could taste the frickin' sugar. The sugar was literally killing you as you eat them, but they're so good. Load recipe. Excellent. Uh, down here for Cyberroids. Yeah, we'll take that again. Deck exit, and we shall work with this. Hang on, I'll go ahead and make a save, just in case. The events, the extra events help with getting the points you need for spamming sandwiches. Something else I was also going to do starting next month, by the way. Um, yeah, we got to wait for the day to end, so let's just do some normal dueling. Let me get into one. Jaden and Blair. Yeah, I don't really want to duel them. <laughs> Jaden's a pain in the ass if he just gets a good opening hand. Hang on. Oh, Mindy. Ah, oh, why not? Let's do it. 
tag duel. Um, my mom actually like, like uh, has been like renting herself a little campground area somewhere far out, and I was gonna like drive out and just kind of like chill there for a couple days every now and then. That seemed like a nice thing to do. She sent me a video of the space um the other day and it looked very cozy. I was thinking like I just like make some plans because you know improve my time management for one. Maybe get some manga and light novels I haven't read yet and just kind of go chill out there and read. Take it easy for a few days. And probably just like post on Twitter. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm not going camping the Doom Scroll. I'm not going to be one of those people. Hold up. There's nothing over... Eh, do I wanna, do I wanna? Heck it. I'm gonna put this down. And we're gonna go with this first. Not like the kind of camping in the, in like a, a tent or anything. Like the kind of little, little campground where it has like a little, like, you know, the little house with like a, a bathroom and like a kitchen inside. You can call it fake camping all you want. It's co it look it looks cozy, and I kind of want to go out to it. All right, this is fine. I'm gonna end on this. I'll let him attack me. Why not? Well, there goes my cards. Molten destruction. Three hundred. It's perfect. Exactly. Not to mention, my mom has also told me, because obviously I'm a streamer and my mom knows this. People think I hide this from my mom for some reason. Um, she says she doesn't mind, like, making the, the trip to drive me back, like, um, so I don't have to, like, commit to being out there for, like, three or four days in a row, you know what I mean? Which I appreciate immensely, because I don't think I could stand that long, stand it that long out there. I just, like, would take a day or two to just kind of unwind and then be like, yep, let's send me back to the... Send me back to the trenches. Let's get back to playing video games. Hold up. Do I want to... Yeah, I think I should just hit the field spell then. Jinzo's negating the trap cards, so we'll do this. Okay. How dare you hide it from your mom. No, people think I... People think streamers don't tell their parents that they're streamers, and that's a weird thing. I'm like, I heard about that the other day, and I'm like, who? Who, do who doesn't do that? <laughs> there we go. Hang on. Before anything else, what else can I... It's not really worth it to bring back Mechanical Chaser, is it? I could sacrifice it for Cyber Dragon, so I think I will. Excellent. I'll do this. Oh, never mind. There it goes. Okay, if that's the case, I think I'll just put Mage Power on Jinzo then. And I'll just set this for a small extra attack boost. Don't be a flip effect. Okay, it's the cat. The cat of ill omen. It searched out a trap card, but it's not like it's going to matter for him. I remember doing, like, real, like, you know, real camping in the tents and all that when I was really young, and I remember really disliking it. I remember, like, just being freaking cold, and I, I remember waking up just freezing. It probably wasn't a great night for it or something, but, like, man, I didn't remember enjoying it. That's all I can say. Okay, let's do this. We have basically won with this. I don't know why I even summoned that. Let's just attack with Jinzo. Um, uh, do I really want to? You know what? Why not? Why not? Why shouldn't we? Why not, chat? Let's just go ahead and activate them both. <laughs> Take that, Mindy. He once went camping in January. That sounds rough. Oh. Well, I got gave me a little bit of a bonus, so I guess I'll take it. Nice. 
Not bad, you're pretty good. Oh yeah, I can't raise the heart anymore. I may as well just go to bed. Let's just do that. Let's make a save and go to bed. Another one. This is why limiter removal is limited. Because you can make stupid ass equations like that happen. End turn. Or end day, sorry. It's late. Let's go to bed. See you tomorrow. Yes, sir. -y. Morning. No slacking, even if it's the weekend. There's a dual tournament today. Um. I'm gonna say no. What? You're not going? Really? I understand. You'll lose if you're with me. I didn't say that. Wow, Jaden Saab. Okay, it skips the day. Wait. Wait, if it skips the day, then how the hell do I get that card outside? I thought skipping it would do that. Well, whatever. Either way, we gotta do the event. Let's ignore the tournament day. Good morning, Asprey. I think I found the connection that the Chancellor said might exist. Zane stopped dueling with respect right after he lost his duel against Aster. Chancellor did say something happened to him in the pro circuit. I was thinking about asking Aster about it, and I'd like you to come along. I I'm a little too weak on my own. Call Jaden and let's go. Come on. All right, then. Let's head outside. I thought not going to the tournament was how you get her to move, but it skipped the day anyway. Well, whatever. Where's that pro duelist? We gotta talk to him. And, is that what you came to ask me about? Well, I thought that seeing as you're a pro too, maybe you'd know something. That's the only reason you called me out? Well, I don't know, know anything. Well, maybe he just went into shock after losing to me. Or maybe he has a connection to underground dueling. It's not the pro leagues, but it's filled with pro duelists. But a desire to win is something I can sort of relate to. Pros. The pros? Of course, Cyrus. Why don't you duel Aster and get a look into the pro world? What? Me duel Aster? Me and Aster? You gotta be kidding me. A duel between Truesdale and Aster? Now that's something I'd like to see. Well, we'll have a tag duel then. You team up with Asprey, and I'll tag with Aster. That's gonna be cool. Hey, Jaden, don't say I'm gonna duel without asking me first. But I guess it's okay this time. I was pretty bored after all. But that's a totally unfair matchup. You guys are too strong. You just wanna duel me, don't you, Jaden? <laughs> oh, I guess I can't hide it. Come on, it'll be fun. Well, I guess you are right about some things. Well, me and Asprey are gonna duel to win. That's the spirit. It's gonna be sweet. I love duels like this. I wanted the duel too. Good luck, everyone. I love when people at Duel Academy are sometimes just like, man, I can't be bothered to duel. The what the hell are you here for, bro? I'll be playing this damn game 24 seven. But then I got older and I realized that esports games are a thing. And let me tell you, if you play a game competitively, they will hate playing that game constantly. Oh, hang on. You have to uh, you have to pair up with Sadie and Dorothy and then the chairman will take their place in the shop and that's what that's how you access the card. Oh, okay. That's fine. I was just curious cuz I thought someone said I just had to skip the Oh, there we go. I just had to skip going to the tournament to be able to do that. E for emergency call. Also, Cyrus threw half his deck away. I'm hoping it pays out for him. It's an interesting play. Let's see how it plays out. All right. If I start with Overload Fusion, I'm going to be very happy. No. Nope. All right, then. Considering he probably just sent Jinzo to the graveyard. Yeah, we can pop Jinzo into play here and then attack with this. Where did it put it? Oh, there it is. Hmm. You know, we could actually just limiter, limiter removal these two since they're going to get destroyed anyway, right? You know, I could. I could. 
this thing's gonna pop the field as soon as Cyrus's turn happens, but it would leave us wide open. Would that be enough, though? 4,400 and 4,800. Not quite. It wouldn't be enough. That's why I'm hesitant about it. I mean... Hmm... I'll just send it for Cyrus's turn. It's not worth it. Diffusion! Alright then. Well, that would have gotten rid of it anyway, so it's fine. The one time Diffusion did something in this damn game, huh? Let's go. It's gonna MST... Oh, wait a second, that's good! <laughs> oh, that's good! Oh no! Please don't stop that thing that's gonna ruin the whole game for us. You know, Cyrus, you have to play a monster. Hmm. <gasps> chat! Chat. It's time. The pro- wait, no, the problem is there's one face down. But if it works! But, but if it works. But if it works. What it- The limiter removal is there. But I wouldn't be able to attack for... I wouldn't be able to attack for games, so I can't use the limiter removal. That wouldn't work. Damn it, I have to wait a turn at least, I'd say. Let me do this to discard you away. I'm, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna just wait. Hang on. Need to make sure there's nothing on the field. First. So I want to do the funny. I really want to do the funny. So let's end on this. Come on, Cyrus. That won't work there. Come on. God dang it. Mm, yeah. No, I need them wide open. Otherwise, limiter removal won't do me any good. I need them to just, like, brick for a second here. That's all we need. Or they end on something in attack mode. Or he could just make it himself. Don't do it. Please don't. Okay, good. Come on. Swords into ring. Jinzo is on the field, my friend. What's the ring gonna do? All right, and he ended on one monster anyway. Damn it. That's a problem. Come on, I really want him to just end on no monsters here so I can do it. Yeah, I forgot about that earlier as well. Jinzo affects your own trap cards. Okay, do this. <sighs> now he has too many back row, damn it. Well, there goes that. Oh no, Cyrus is gonna use his heavy storm, isn't he? Another Jinzo. One's doing that there. It's, he has too many face downs now. It's not worth it. It's not worth it at all, so I'm just gonna do this. Okay, we're gonna attack you. No problem. And now, we're gonna do this and just attack for game. They didn't give us the position we wanted to be able to do the funny, but this is still funny enough. Eight oh one. Oh, we lost, but that was one sweet duel. 
What did you expect tagging uh, out of the blue like that? Oh well, it was a good way to kill some time. I almost forgot. Have you guys ever heard of the power of darkness? What an abrupt change in conversation. Power of darkness? It's like the light of destruction that Sartorius used to talk about when he was my manager. Thank you, Twisted Squid, for another sub there. Appreciate it. They sort of possess and change you into something like Zane is now. Well, I've never actually seen it, but that's what I heard. Does that mean that Zane is being controlled by the power of darkness? Bro, 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 bro. Can you imagine? Can you imagine if, like, you had a sibling that stopped gaming with respect and your first thought is, oh my goodness, the power of darkness must have corrupted them. It has to be that. What else could it be? I don't know. Anyway, I have an appointment. See you guys later. Zane sure does seem a lot like Atticus back when he was a Shadow Rider. Back when he was taken over by the power of darkness. If that's true, I have to save Zane. But you didn't know what that was a few moments ago. What are you talking about? This is terrible. Darkness. If your girlfriend breaks up with you, power of darkness. If your crush rejects you, it's the power of darkness, chat. It's not your fault. Sadie's here. No, she's not working here because uh, the power of darkness has decided that Mondays are her days off. There we go. Do you believe in the power of darkness, chat? How many dates of yours has it ruined? I'm gonna bake my cookies, and if you all don't like them, well, I guess I, I guess that's just the power of darkness once again at work. Uh oh. Yeah, let's not use that one. Are we at one, two, three, four, five, six, seven? Okay, so the next heart is the last one, and we haven't even seen Zane yet. What a stellar use of my time this has been. All right, I'm doing a little stretch right here, chat. I should do more of a proper stretch right now. No one redeemed it, but I have um, been sitting terribly and feeling terrible uh, this weekend again, so I should take care. Power of darkness causes your insomnia. Yes, it does. Ooh, nice. He liked the lobster. No golden sandwich. Chat, would you try a tangerine sandwich? There we go. That was a regular egg. That wasn't a gold egg. There we go. Hydration. Don't mind if I do. There's the gold egg. There we go. Wow, things are coming up, Millhouse. All right, let's save the game and just end the day then. Yay. Chat, what if you peeled an orange and you just like, you know, you took all the pe all the pieces of the orange apart on the inside and you laid them out on a sandwich between some bread, right? Would you eat that sandwich? Or would it disgust you? Oh, what am I doing? I wanted to just end the day, and now I'm just waste going in and out, wasting time. Okay, chat, you ready for the Cyrus finale? I'm not. Morning, I've been thinking about it, but I think Zane has been taken over by the power of darkness. Ah, oh, damn it, it was the power of darkness. It can't be anything else. What else could it be? I think Zane has been taken over by the power of darkness, chat. I'm gonna save him. I'm gonna go duel Zane. If I beat him in a duel, maybe I can bring back the real Zane. Well. Guess we gotta go do that now. He's at the volcano. Oh, he's playing with Atticus. Zane, duel me. Hm, you never give up, do you? You're just here now. He's got the turtleneck and everything. I know the truth. You've given in to the power. The power of darkness, and it's taken you over. I've read fanfics with better build-up than this. 
No, it's an insult to fanfix. I shouldn't say that. Cyrus, is that true? Darkness. Cyrus, you mean that Zane has me? Darkness? Yeah, right. I have no need for the darkness. Enough talk. I accept your challenge. I don't care what the reason. If there's a chance to win, I take it. Zane, you... Fine, then. If that's the way it has to be, I'll be your partner. And once again, use the power of darkness. What? Atticus, no. Why would you? Alexis, you'll see once the duel is over. I'll be fine, even if the darkness takes me over. Atticus, you're a fool. Cyrus, you still want a duel? Of course, I won't run away. I'm going to bring you back from the darkness. Asprey and I are unstoppable as partners. Cyrus, Asprey, go get them. But Jaden, don't worry, Alexis, we'll look after them. <laughs> Here I come. All right. Now we get to duel Zane, everybody. It's Zane! Who was even left for me to play with after this? I don't know. I don't- I can't remember. Oh, cool. He just transformed into Night Shroud. Underworld, Alt, and Darkness. Chat, I wish I had a cool black trench coat I could take out with a cool mask and just be like, I've activated my darkness mode. I've said the word darkness so much in the past five minutes, it doesn't even feel like a real word anymore. Excellent. Here we go. Dark Magician Girl's not a tier one character, though. She doesn't have no story. You're attacking. You're taking 1,800 points of damage and you're attacking. Well, well, well. Look what I've drawn, chat. Immediately into my funny stuff. Good power bond, but would it be worth it? Not really. Let's go ahead and call back Reflect Bounder, because why the hell not? I say we do a little funny. Put the mage power down. That's big number. And I'll go ahead and put this down, too. Hmm... I'm scared to let Cyrus access this, to be honest, but we could probably win with this anyway. Why not? Let's do it. All right. Don't flip up anything. Damn it all, oh, man. I was really banking on that. Oh, well. I got Mirror Force. That's illegal. That That's a certified Power of Darkness mood right, move right there. Ooh. 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 You know what could happen, chat? Hang on a second. He got his future fusion. Cyber Dark Dragon. Uh-oh. Cyber Dark Impact. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. And he just equipped Red Eyes from the graveyard. Now, see, this is a problem right here. We may have just... Yeah, we, we're kind of screwed now. <laughs> okay, Cyrus. Show the world what you're made of. Never mind. We may have lost. Yeah, we, we, we're kind of... We're kind of screwed. Foolish Burial. Throwing red eyes out of there again. Hmm. All this because of Mirror Force. Gosh darn it. That's really silly. I should have won on the grounds that I wanted to. Is that really not enough anymore? Power of Darkness is so stingy. Let's do it. We're gonna win. It's gonna be cool. Hmm. Mechanical Chaser. 
put down his limiter removal. He's going future fusion right away. Ah. Huh? Oh. Zane also was running FGD. Oh. Too bad somebody's got an MST to say no to that. All right, then. We got limiter removal there. We got premature burial, but nothing in the graveyard. I think I should just set this thing and play it safe. And that, too. Let's get him. I knew it. And now it's gone. He can't play another one. Atticus can, though. Um... No, we don't need to solemn that thing. There's plenty of other things in this deck we'd, we'd rather solemn. I am gonna flip this up, though. Mm, okay, I'll take that. I'll take that. Uh-oh, don't do that. There's no point in paying half my life points to stop it. He's top decking Mirror Force. I know, what is his problem? Can you believe he'd cheat against me? So unacceptable. 800 points. He's bringing back Cyber Dragon. He's playing Giant True Nade. Uh oh. That's a problem. Draw phase is skipped, huh? I'm better off just setting this then for now. Let me see here. If I put down the steamroid, I can attack into that. So let's go ahead and use the premature burial here. Just hoping we don't proc another mirror force, or maybe we can. That would be safe. And put this down. To play it safe. Any flips? Okay, good. True anime characters cheat. That's right. I'm an anime character now. So I must cheat. Hunter Dragon. Uh-oh. Don't, don't, oh, that's bad. He's putting down the Reflect Bounder. Okay, he got that again. Holy crap, he's got so much. No anime character on the side of the screen for this one, but you never know. I probably will put it out there soon. Hang on. Um, that would not, it would not be safe to go for that. It would not be safe to go for that at all. Better off just sacrificing King of the Swamp right now. Yay. I don't have a schedule posted right now, no. I have too much stuff happening this week to, like, actually post what I'm going to be doing yet. Let's see. For now... Mm, I could crash them into each other like this, but just do this for now. Ah! Well, that sucks. Wait, I can't attack. Why can't you attack? I just end the battle phase there? Did he do something else to stop the battle phase? Oh, right, that, that thing's effect. Blizzard Dragon, I forgot about that. Now, I usually have a schedule post on the Discord. But, uh, right now, too much crap happened this weekend, so I just don't have anything ready. Hang on. I just know I'm still probably sticking to the main plan of, of taking off Mondays and Fridays. He's still gonna do it. He's bringing back that. Oh, he's using Inferno Fire Blast. Okay. Cyrus, we are doomed. I should have set Overload Fusion for you to use, honestly.
Come on. We should be able to tank this. Come on. That one face down, chat. That one face down. Two backup plans. All right, then. Let's do it. We're going to make Chimera attack. We're going to put them all on. Let's hope that last face down of theirs isn't Mirror Force. Everything goes. All or nothing. Even if it buff yours to, buffs yours too. No, it doesn't. Okay, good. No flips. Yeah. What a disgusting win. We did it! Zane? Atticus, are you okay? Tag duels. I hate them. <laughs> this is me after partnering with 90% of the cast. <laughs> they just prolonged victory. Cyrus, I already told you. I'm not taken by the darkness. I just changed the way I live. It has opened the door to more possibilities. Zane. Wait, Zane. Why? Why, Zane? Cyrus, you remember when I dueled Zane, don't you? Yeah? I lost all control of myself and was taken over by the darkness. But Zane, he saved me from the pits of darkness. And just now, I saw Zane clearly in the light. Ah, Zane. Well, I'm glad. Glad he hasn't been taken over by the darkness. That's sort of a relief. I was afraid he was taken over. By what? what? What was he taken over by? Sorry, I'm not following along. What was it called? Did it start with a D, maybe? Cyrus? In that case, I believe he'll return. The Zane Truesdale I respect. Cyrus. Cyrus and Asprey, that was a sweet duel. You guys really are unbeatable as tag partners. Aw, shucks, you're making me blush, Jaden. You two dorks make a matching team. What do you mean by dork, Princeton? You're the one with dorky monsters in your deck. Ooh, he went there. He went there, chat. What? I don't have anything like that in my deck. Well, I guess some of them look weird, but... Okay, then. You use a weird deck. Yeah, a weird deck. My deck is not weird. It's just my three ojamas that are. Get away from me. I didn't call you guys. So what if I called you weird? Get out of here. Hey, Asprey, let's leave this weirdo and get out of here. <laughs> weirdo, you stupid slacker. Hey, guys, I'll race you to the cafeteria. I get the loser's food. Ha 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 ha. Jaden, all you think about is eating and dueling. But I won't lose, dear. Wait up. How dare you insult the Chaz and then run off? Wait a second. Isn't today fried shrimp? Hey, Asprey, thanks for the duel. I don't think I would have won without you. All right, so there's no conflict resolution here. Zane is still mean. You're definitely who I want as a partner, but I really only respect Jaden. What the hell is... Excuse me? You don't respect me? Excuse me? You think after how you've played these past few episodes, you have any right to say that? I had to make your deck for you. There we go. What a absolute little shit. <laughs> wow. Wow, this relationship isn't going to work, Cyrus. Pack up your cards and give me back mine and get the hell out of get the hell out of my dorm room. No, 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 no. Once again, another breakup brought to you by the power of darkness. Konami. All right. This dating sim sucks. Yes, it does. All right, who's left? 
let me see. Story mode from the beginning. Will you watch the opening day event? No. Okay, we haven't played with Alexis and Blair. Is it really down to these two? Damn. Okay. All right, then let's let's finally do Blair. She she's apparently has some really garbage cards, so this will be funny. She's not going to be able to get away with this. All right, Asprey and Blair. What do I what do I call this? What do I call this name? Uh, change team 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 name. Let me see. Love Bears. <laughs> okay. We'll call it Love Bears, why not? I was gonna call it Have a Seat, but I'm not sure if like, I put that all in there with its spaces. Hang on. Bears. Kawaii Bears. No. Blair Bears. No. Just put Love Bears, it's fine. Start button. Yeah! Morning, Asprey. Come on. Early bird gets the worm. Hey, today's the first day. Get up. Anyway, we're going to be partners from today on, so keep alert. Because I'll be here to wake you up every day. Hee <laughs> hee. How terrible are you? How terrible are you? Let me see. Hang on. I should switch my decks first. Uh... I'll, I'll keep the cyber dragons on for one duel. Let's just fight them. Queen's era being released. Why not? Supposedly, she's the worst character to play with from the beginning. She has the worst deck, but because we're so late into this with so many playthroughs, that means... <laughs> um, I should have cards to do this. Chat, I don't think I should just end it after Alexis. I think people want me to also do a playthrough with Sadie or something. Like, we could probably do that. Her, her burn cards would compliment me, wouldn't it? Okay, what she got? She got Shining Angels. I don't really have fairy cards. I don't really want to play fairy cards. It set up Teddy Toll to work with uh, her maiden. What about that? Teddy Toll is always a good excuse. First, let's just do this with my Cyber Dragons. She'll give us life points, too. The oh, yeah, the her life point cards can actually be okay for this. And we'll do this. Attack. Cocoon of Evolution. Get it. Take as much Yu-Gi-Oh as you can get. Yeah, don't worry. We're doing lots of Yu-Gi-Oh. We're playing lots of games this week. It's amazing. Teddy Toll is good because Teddy. Yes, it is. Uh, when this card is normal, summon plays two counters. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Okay. Okay. Hang on. What's she doing? Insect tokens. Well, that's a whole lot of nothing. All right. Play your maiden. See if you can do this. Nope. They're going to wall a revealing light instead. I wish I started with my teddy toll because they're pissing me off. Some of her cards are made-up anime ones that aren't actually printed at this point. I don't know if they ever got printed, to be fair. Hmm. Effects aren't really gonna do much for me here. We can attack. Um... Power Bonding Chimera Tech's not gonna give me enough power to beat over that either. Damn it, let's just end. Gulky Boar. Uh, I'll just ring a destruction, you, because I don't even care. Saving Proto Cyber Dragon so I can maybe make Cyber Twin or something. Small Metal Life Point game. 
Aromages don't exist, so we can't really play that with Blair, even though it would kind of fit. Oh, good. You mirror forced that tiny little thing. Blair's trying her best. Okay. Um... I can't really do anything is the problem. Face up in the field. When a main encounter monster attacks this card. We gotta get rid of that wall of revealing light. That's the problem. The maiden needs its equip card, basically, yeah. Oh, she's flipping it up. Why would you do that? Swarm of locusts. There goes that. Why would you do that? Why would you do that, Blair? Why would you put that in attack mode, hmm? Hmm? There's some, there's some kind of plan that you, uh, forgot to let me in on? There we go. She's baiting the AI, I guess. Oh. Maneater Bug just runs over and just devoured that princess. She's freaking dead, and it was like Mortal Kombat levels of gore. I'm sorry, everyone, but it was a violent end. Kaiba's hologram technology has gone too far. That's why Duel Academy is, uh, you gotta be old enough to attend it. The real reason, everybody. I literally can't do anything. I can't get rid of that wall. You know, they just kind of explode into, like, uh, little bits, I think. Yeah, that's great. Blair is apparently amazing in Tag Force 3, but not so much here. Okay, let's do it. Let's do something. That wall of revealing light has just walled us, literally. Yeah. We're just gonna take it easy, enjoy dueling with her for a bit. We're not gonna be able to get her late events done at all. Oh, nice! This is even better. This is what I was waiting for. Hell yes. Um, now that we've done that... Unhappy Maiden has got to go. From this frickin' deck, I tell ya. Put this down anyway. Now that we can attack again... This does that. Let's go ahead and just get rid of the generic monsters first, cause who cares? Nice. Not sure, I could try spellcasters later, but I don't know. For now, I think, because she plays like a stall strategy, we could play Teddy Toll a little bit again. More ant tokens. Come on, do it. Win. It's turn 21 and nothing's happening. How is Yugi Mons going? Oh, it's going just fine. Let me see. Nothing's happening, though, because this guy has stalled the whole damn game. I can't put down more monsters because she decided to do that. Yeah. Yeah, let's just do this for now. Steamroid attacks this thing. It's going to summon another freaking monster. Ah. Uh, do that. She's playing like fairies and spellcasters, yeah. After today, chat, I'm gonna have a ton of stuff to upload this week. I'm already a little bit behind because of Mother 3 getting a claim again. And I have like an extra Mario Party game too. <laughs> Man, I have so much I need to get done. I'm gonna see if I can get some extra thumbnails done tonight so I don't have any more... Yeah, I have more backup plans in case of more claims. Okay, we finally won. Good. Let me pick a different deck. Nice going, we did it. Okay, deck menu, deck edit. Okay. Load recipe. I've not played Dragon Quest anything, no friend. Let me see. Oh, what am I doing? Hang on. Uh, Teddy Toll is up here. This should work just fine. 
I don't think Blair is dumb enough to attack with the Blast Sphere. Yet, yeah, Flip Monsters and Slow Burn should actually synergize perfectly with her. Let's make her pay the toll. Exiled forever. Okay, let's warm up on these chumps. Agnul again. Teddy needs money for cookies. He needs money to for me to buy things to bake cookies. That's what it's really all about right now. I planned on taking tomorrow off. Um, I get the opportunity to go to the gym tomorrow. I probably should do it. My sleep has been a little bit iffy. I, I should just go to the gym, to be honest. A part of me just wants to get out of it and, like, rest a bit more, but it's probably going to do me... I'll probably feel much better in the long run if I do it. It's just such a pain in the ass to get out there to that particular one for me. Okay, smashing ground, done. Nice. I also actually... I wanted to get a new pair of headphones for the gym, right? Or earbuds, I should say. But you know what happened? I bought one. And then I realized it, uh, that headphones don't plug into phones the same way they used to anymore. And I'm like, oh, right, that was a thing. My phone is old as hell. <laughs> so, no headphone jacks. They have to, like, plug into, like, the uh, weird port now. Okay, let's do it. For me, it's not necessarily, like, the idea of going to the gym I hate. I hate, like, just going into, like, crowded places. And sometimes the gym... The gym is just crowded now that it's warming up a bit, right? That's my main issue, I'd say. Ah, uh, do I want a chain or toll? I'd rather go with chain, to be honest. That's more funny. Let's do this. I am... No, I don't have an Apple phone. I've had, like, a Samsung for, like, the past decade, I think. I think I've, it's been almost a decade. Okay. Anyways, that took care of that. Let's let them play. Most phones lack them now. Ugh. That sucks. She got Marshmallow. That's good. Did I put Marshmallow in this deck, actually? Skull Zuma. Alright, this is fine. Oh, one of the worst days you can go to at the gym, I'm finding, is like, um, the one I go to has like a free workout day every month. And when you go there during that day, it's just absolutely freaking crowded. And I we went there not even realizing it, it was going to be a free workout day, but geez. Absolutely crowded. People clogging up the cardio machines. Of course people are going to take advantage of that. Yeah. Hang on. I'll just throw this down because we can. Don't matter. I just don't like being in, in uh, spaces that are just filled with so many people. My so socially introvert... Yeah, socially anxious introvert self cannot handle it. Alright, I'm gonna put this down, and we basically win. Michael here won't be able to really attack or play cards anymore. If anything, I'd prefer to go out to the walking trails with, like, my mom or something again. I like getting to walk in the open, cool air. Much better. Okay, that's that. He attacked into the Marshmallow, and we got game. Okay, that's working. I lost. Oh, well. See you next duel. Teddy Toll does seem to work with her cards, but we definitely need to edit her deck, for sure. Fusion Utopia. Super Strength. Let's duel him. Get his 10th victory. Let's do it, chat. Let's do it. First to go, and second to go. Oh no, I absolutely don't want to sit inside all day, that's for sure. Ugh. I just hate, hate making the drive out there over and over. Unhappy Maiden. Maiden's Kiss. What, is that, what does that do again? 
Main encounter, controller, takes man. Oh, you're right, 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 yeah. If the equipped monster attacks a monster with a mate encounter on it, and the controller of the equipped monster takes battle damage... Hmm. Yeah. Uh, take control of the monster, then inflicts battle damage to the player's life points at the end of the damage step. That is such an annoying amount of setup for that. You know what I mean? Now, what do we got? Enchanted Javelin and that thing. Could play those to bounce. Could play these to mill. I think I'll do this. Yeah, we're gonna go all in. Hmm. Okay, we'll end it. Chain energy is fun, because if you just throw down three of them, they gotta play so much. You know what? I'll allow it. I don't need to pay half my life points to stop this. King of the Swamp. And, and uh, the Gorgon with Great Mammoth of gold fine. I love old fusion monsters so much. Medusa and a dragon zombie make a great mammoth. You tell me how that makes sense. You can't. <laughs> Alright, she's gonna go for it. She's gonna throw her whole hand away. Interesting play there, Blair. I can see why the maidens you own are very unhappy. Ooh, snatch deal. She's putting that in attack mode. She's going on the attack. It did nothing. Snatch deal. Is this one of the edited monster cards again? I think I've asked this before about this specific monster, or maybe it was her color alt, but... I know some of the- one of the mermaid cards had some kind of edit, right? For the localization? I can't recall. Dark Room of Nightmare, we can do that. Nothing worth- nothing to really revive here, yeah. So I'll set this. Mmm. No burns happening. Do I even need to put this down? Not really. Could just leave it up as a deterrent then. Hmm. Or better yet, just do this. Let them pop their own monsters, why would, don't we? Oh, what am I doing? That was silly of me, I know, I know. <laughs> I didn't realize what the defense on the mermaid was. Wasted that. Chain energy. Mmm, okay, that's fine. Go ahead. Get bounce. Get bounced. They gotta keep playing their life points to play more cards. It won't help them. And I love seeing chain energy just pop off over and over. It's funny. What is she doing? Stop that. Stop that. What are you doing? What are you doing, girl? Stop that. Oh, there we go. Blair, what are you doing? What, what are you doing, girl? Local man screams at child for being bad at Yu-Gi-Oh. Shield type 8. Counter spell. Okay. No, Blair is just trying to play strangely. Our decks work fine. She just, like, it feels like she doesn't even know how to use her own cards. What is that thing? O Ultimate Obedient Fiend. I've never seen this before. What is it? This card can only attack if this card is the only card on your side of the field and you also have no cards in your hand. The effects of effect monsters that, are, that this card destroys are negated. I've never seen this card before. What is it? What, where is it? When did this come out? Is it an anime-only thing? That's a bad card. Yeah, you're telling me. No special summit? You have to tribute too anyway to get it on the field. That's stupid. Why would I do that? Well, I'll just do this then. It's a level 10, I guess. And I'll put this down because we can. 
And there's not really any reason to bring anything back. I say we're good. It seems like one of those pack filler common cards, yeah. You open it and you think like, damn, it must be good. Go ahead, attack me, bro. They won't be able to stop me. Apprentice Magician is dead. Oh, they're not attacking anything else, huh? Happy marriage. Uh-oh, there goes that. <laughs> they're making this take forever. Everything shall be okay. Cyber Dinosaur. Is this supposed to be called Cybersaurus? This must maybe this is before it was like translated or something. Fizzled out, baby. <laughs> Why can't they just attack the damn koala? Well, it's too late now. We're just gonna put this down. We're almost in a position to go for game. So let's do this. Hello, friend. Welcome to the stream. Take a thousand. Take 300 more. Attack my... Let me flip the koala and we win. Blair, can you flip the koala? Can you flip the koala? You're not going to flip the koala, are you? No, she's not. She doesn't get it. Flip the koala. And there we go. Excitement. New high score bonus for what? Number of times countered an opponent's move. Two. All right, then. I didn't take it easy on you at all. You really beat me. Let's duel again. That guy had an annoying setup to duel that. Yeah. Um... Let's just duel the, one of the strongest characters in the game. That, that'll go well. That'll, that'll go well. That'll be fancy. That'll be nice. Excellent. First to go, second to go. Maiden's Kiss, Teddy Toll. By the way, chat, I still have no idea. If you play with Alexis, does it affect her story at all if you use her, uh, whether you play with her as normal or mind-controlled version? I have no clue, but, if, but I have the option to change it. All right, there's my wave motion cannon, finally. Been waiting to see one of these for a bit. Um, do we have the protection here? Not really can't beat over a stealth bird should be okay I'm gonna go ahead and MST whatever's back there just to play it safe call the haunted good call let me get a drink that thing's gone don't mind if I do all right I had a sip of my water no worries 1400. Okay, multiple sevens. Stealth bird. She knows to flip and dip. Ooh, ooh. What's this thing? Oh no, they're gonna soul exchange it. Never mind, she can counter it. Oh, that's Mobius. Oh, that's Sangan. Well, that kind of that's kind of poopy butts. Black pendant. Damn it. All right then. You can only activate this card while there's a face-up maiden in love on your side of the field. When your opponent attacks one of your monsters, you can change the target to maiden of love. This maiden has so much setup to um not really be worth it. Doesn't doesn't she? 
And I'm not going to be able to take out any of the cards for it, or... I just know it. Well, we can't really defend, but this will burn her for a bunch. And I'm going to put down this because screw Disa. Power of darkness, baby. Stall tactics. Ooh, take 2,000, girl. Nothing to end on, huh? What are you doing? Please, are you gonna... Okay, she set that. She set it. She set the magician circle. Effect was not activated. Oh, we're in trouble. Well then. If we can just burn her enough... That she can't play any more cards. Maybe this will be okay. Okay. We're gonna go for the secret barrel. The secret is that they lose. 2,000. Nice. Um, okay. My effect still goes off. Nice. We beat Disa. Excellent. Yay, we did it. Darn, I guess I still need practice. Let's duel again. Okay, she finally likes me a bit more. Okay. What about inside the Chaz room? No one is present in the Chaz room? Unbelievable. Fine, then. Let's get out of here. The deck's kind of synergized, but Blair's just doesn't have a very good deck, period. Okay, Dead End for Nova, Queen's Perfume. Why not? I still haven't beaten him ten times somehow. Let's do it, chat. Okay. Oh yeah, I kind of forgot there's even a pack for her character, right? If I bought stuff, it'd probably just give me the Maiden in Love cards. I don't know if I... I, I don't really want to run the same strategy she's doing. That would be slow as hell. Even more slow as hell as we're already doing. The A forces. And she gave up Swords of Revealing Light to stop a 200 attack boost to warrior monsters. GG, Blair. Good job. What would we what would we ever do without you? Okay. Do this, do that. We're going all in Teddy style. We can flip up DD Warrior Lady. DD Warrior Lady looks so like distressed right now. Like she looks like she just really wants to go home and have a shower. Maybe it's a little too pixelated for me to make out her expression, but like she just looks like she's just done. Like, she's, like, just done. That's what one of the Ds stands for, actually. There we go. I guess that's that. Soul Absorption. Whatever. Gold Sarcophagus. Whatever. Necroface. Once again, a big fat whatever. Come on, do something, Nova. You think you can recover enough? You getting rid of my cards, huh? Any day now. Oh, that's 5,000 life points. Hmm. Cut that out. Cut that out. <laughs> what is your problem, Nova? No, Blair, flip the damn bird first. Oh. No, you know why Dee Dee Warrior Lady looks distressed? She got, she, her relationship ended because of the power of darkness. It's gotta be that. What else could it be? Detective Cyrus told me so, and he's never wrong about these things. Well, guess we're gonna charge the wave motion cannon for a few thousand turns. You know, that's it. That'll be easy to do. 
chain energy would just be a big detriment to ourselves because they, they can pay whatever they want right now. You know what I mean? Let's flip. Let's just do this. Yeah, let's do that. Yep. Yeah. How bad does a breakup have to be for you to succumb to the power of darkness? Or wait, no, the power of darkness causes the breakup. We've established this. What am I doing? I guess that's that for now. Her lore is she had to watch Warrior Die Greffer get turned into Dark Die Greffer. Oh, no. 1,000. Dark Room of Nightmare. This is okay. Flip the Stealth Bird. We're still going to take it back. We're still going to take it back. Two stealth birds. Watch. <laughs> we'll do this. They're not going to outlast us. Go ahead. Pay your life points. Pay your freaking life points. See if we care. See if we care. You're back to 8,000, Nova. Here comes the tomato. Here comes the necro face. Here comes mirror force. Get out of here. Unfortunately, that's another 1,000 life points for you. <sighs> Just keeps going. Oh my... I picked the worst people to freaking duel with this deck. That's what I did. That's, that's what I did, chat. Why... <laughs> Why did I duel this person? I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> All right, put it back down, I guess. Nova is literally the worst for this right now. <laughs> he got his perfect setup and everything, too. I'm going to get a record for life point damage, if nothing else. Fair enough. Okay, this is at... We can't even activate this because... We can't send it to the graveyard because of that guy's effect, so the, we're not even allowed to resolve it. Ah, we need an MST to pop. Uh, not an MST. We need to, like, attack him and get rid of him. That's what we need to do. Well, then. I, I guess we'll end, end the turn. Maybe? Guess we'll put her in defense mode. She can't do anything. I'm mad. Foolish Burial. Stop gaining life points. He's playing a thing. Oh, chat, I'm gonna just... While we wait for this duel to happen over the next year, I'm just gonna pour myself some more fizzy water in my glass. How about that? There we go. Get it nice and close to the mic. Can they get that sweet ASMR? There we go. Actually, that's kind of bad. I don't want to get it... Get, accidentally get it wet. That would be bad. All right. Oh, is it our turn yet? Did she burn enough? You damn well better have. One thousand. I don't know if the game has a program limit to life points. Can't resolve this either. Well, this will certainly help us. Now then. All we can do now is flip the two stealth birds over and over and hope they don't get killed. No idea if the game can crash from something. I've had this I've had the Switch version of Legacy of the Duelist crash on me before. If you have like too many cards in your hand, sometimes it can just crash because it can't handle it. I've never heard of the Tag Force games crashing though. From some kind of like ridiculous setup. Have we have we ever seen this game lag before though? I feel like it has when there's a bunch of effects going on. 
We almost got him back to the starting amounts. Here we go. Blair, I am begging you, just flip. Just flip them to birds. No pun intended. Actually, no, I do intend to, uh... Actually, you know what, Nova? Yeah, I'm gonna hold them up right now. We're gonna give him the two stealth birds, all right. Stretch, no problem. Ugh. I'm just standing here flipping birds at him over and over until he dies, because he just... We can't do anything. He's got wall revealing light and that one card that won't let us resolve the wave motion cannon. Because we can't send it to the grave. Oh no. 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 <laughs> no. <sighs> there she goes. Hang on, what's her effect say? Destroy the result of battle. Oh, that's why you don't set it, girl. Let's set you down. Here we go again. We're getting milled, I know. We're gonna deck out at this rate. We can do this. We can do this, Teddies. We can do this. Just gotta keep going. Just gotta keep believing. There's two dark rooms of nightmares. Okay, now we put this down. All right, and we'll end. Ooh, so sorry. Sending this back won't do any good, because he can just put it back down. And the wall revealing light stops attacks anyway. Nope. Nothing the bounce can really do for us. Actually, wait, no. Couldn't I have just targeted the wall revealing light and made them pay again? Yeah, I should have did that. It's too late, though. It's too late. Let it go, chat. It's fine. It's fine. We're almost here. We've almost won. Probably. This thing has nine frickin' counters on it, too, and we can't resolve it because of his damn effect. That's it. Next turn, you're done. You're done. You're cooked. And we're gonna have a massive high score. Just watch. Don't give him more life points. An MST would be great now. Nope. We can do this, right? We, we can win. We can win this turn, chat. Look at that. We're gonna flip Stealth Bird. It's almost done. Don't worry. Just one more. One more. One more. He's got nothing. Giri and Nova have lost. I want to see what the high score says. We absolutely have some kind of high score for this. 40 DP for it. Total damage, number of flip summons. <laughs> we did almost that much damage. Oh my goodness, that was boring. Wow. Amazing. Only worth 20 DP, too. I lost. I gotta relax. Next time I'll duel more. Let's keep the pace up. Bear Strength. Trinity. Yeah, sure. Let's duel them now. That's a lot of freaking damage right there we had to do. No, what Nova would have had us wall for a good while there, yeah. Unfortunately, he drew his... He had his perfect cards to get set up early on there.
Maiden Kiss and Teddy Bear Toll. Marshmallow. Nope, no, put the marshmallow down. That's more important. The A Force Spiel. Well, at least you have a useless spell to discard. I think Blair should build her deck around teddy bears. That'd be wholesome. Okay, we got the teddy toll. That's good. Hmm. Pay the toll, buddy. We're going all in. Um, do I want to attack with the warrior? Honestly, I think I should. Mm. Let's do it. I'll pay my 500. Ah, uh, it was Command Knight. That was a waste. No, no, let them attack into me to activate that. That's fine. I ate crap for it, but now they have an empty field and they gotta pay to play on it. Machine or Sniper. Oops. Did I just activate my bottomless? Yes, I did. My body is a shield. Uh. Uh. Oh no. Sure. Whatever. Don't take 1,500 points of damage. Don't. That would absolutely uh upset me. Now yeah, they gotta pay the toll. Yeah, let's do that. This is great. Pay 500? Now this is how my deck should be popping off right now, yeah. Now check that out. Now they're down to nothing. Just set the marshmallow and we're good. Claire... Not Claire. Blair, sorry. I... <laughs> Blair has um, some cards to heal us, so that can help mitigate the cost of chain energy on herself, too. Oh, she's got that, huh? Hmm. I'll just set you, then. She can't even afford to attack. We basically got her, yeah. I just need to get one flip effect and just resolve it. What are you doing? What are you doing, girl? Oh, Stealth Bird. Okay, we can just do that. Just put Stealth Bird down and resolve it on Blair's turn and we win. Bear strength, exactly. Teddy's about to win yet again. Also, what kind of a last name is Flanagan? Like, what does that mean? What a random ass, like, jumbled mess of syllables. I apologize if anyone's watching and they have that name. I know I'm not one to talk, but still. Oh, shoot. You beat me. Take it easy on me, will ya? It's an Irish surname. Right on. Let's keep going. Irish viewers crying right now. So she's just Irish? I guess so. There's Bastion. There's Jim. I hate Jim. He's mean. He bullies me. Body Blast. Oh, let's get our 10th win on Woody. Why not? Yeah, let's do it. I guess they... I mean, I know they don't want to call every localized character name as, like, you know, John Smith or something. Let me see. Usually they try to have, like, some last names a little bit on the nose. On the nose, if they can. It really depends. Ace Attorney's pretty wild for its localized names. Like, I know for, like, Miles Edgeworth, I think, like, his last name... I, I think, like, in Japanese, his last name is, like, Mitsurugi. So, like, because that's, like, known as a samurai name, that's why they named him Edgeworth in the localization. I thought that was kind of funny. 
We can just immediately pop this down, I guess. I feel like waiting for it to resolve. Chain strike. Hit him for 800. And we'll put down Dark Room of Nightmare. I'll put, go ahead and put down Secret Barrel. Um, Ceasefire will be funny after the attack goes through, though. Oh, right. Light of Intervention. Yeah, there's nothing we can really do about that, which is funny. All right, we're fine. End turn. You know, that's true. On the subject of Yu-Gi-Oh!, what, what kind of a name is Taya? I have, I don't know... I've never heard of a single person with the first name Taya. Like... <laughs> I guess I'll go ahead and redo this, too. I should have saved Chainburn, but it's whatever. You have... The name Taya Gardner, like, sounds so specific. I feel like it's gotta be some kind of, like like, nod to the meaning of her Japanese name, but I don't know what it means. Okay. Well, we got beamed a little bit there, but that's okay. She gonna snatch steal? You gonna, you gonna MST that light of intervention? No. Oh? Oh? Why would you give up your MST, you dumb... I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna yell at the child. I'm not gonna yell at the child over Yu-Gi-Oh chat, I promise. But I am going to internally criticize her. <laughs> okay. Well, that worked out. Berserk Gorilla. Well, we taking 4K, we getting the Gorilla beatdown all of a sudden. Um, yeah, we're kind of screwed. That heavy storm kind of destroyed us, like it always does. The Monk Fighter. Take the 1200. Oh, that's not good. We don't even get the satisfaction of battle damage. Blair, come on. Destiny Draw. Okay, I'm really glad you had the foresight to make that your destiny draw. Proud of you. Solemn wishes. Well, I guess we'll set you and hope we win. I'm the one that's doing nothing in this duel now. It's all up to Blair to save our ass. Take that 500. That mirror force is going to save our ass later, for sure. Okay. Burning land would not give me the edge I need, I feel. Hmm. Now, let's just get rid of the mirror force. We can do this. Yes. Come on, Mirror Force, let's go. No! Chat. It's Yugi over right now. No! I got beamed. Oh, man. Well... We almost did well. Not for that heavy storm. 42. Wow, I won. Don't get all down in the dumps now. I'm always up for another duel. We lost? We won't do well if we keep doing like this. I'm trying. Okay? I'm trying my best. Gosh. Scissors and that there. Yeah, sure, let's go. Oh, man. Okay, I need to win. That's that's just what I need to do. What is the theme of Woody's deck exactly? Other than vanity, apparently. Is the whole point of... 
No, Maiden in Love is a spellcaster, so... Oh, well, there goes those. So, Shining Angel isn't for searching out Maiden in Love. Oh, finally! We haven't seen Blasphere in, like, an eternity. They already used up a Heavy Storm. The other one's probably got one in his deck. So... Hmm... You can just do this first. Yeah. Oh my goodness, you insufferable little shit. No! Damn it. I accidentally went over to no. Oh well, an extra 500's gone now. Um, okay. Now you've activated it. Good job, Weenie. <laughs> Both heavy storms <laughs> got activated back to back. Oh, well. Marshmallow. Marshmallow. No! Put the freaking marshmallow down! What's wrong with you? Not gonna do it. It got removed from play, so it can't do its recruit effect. <sighs> well then. I need a new hand, but Penguin can't be beaten over in this situation, so let's do this. <laughs> Gaia power, let's go for it. I shouldn't yell at Blair, but Blair is Blair can't hear me, chat. She is a she is an anime character program. She cannot hear a thing I'm saying. But hang on. Uh, yeah, we'll just bounce the monster. Let's do that. But still, you shouldn't yell at anyone for play when they play Yu-Gi-Oh wrong. Excellent. Excellent. That reminds me of a thing that, like, I, I, I am somewhat glad that we've, like, um... Have definitely moved chat away from, like, people being weird and coming in trying to, like, uh... Hang on. You know, trying to do the friendly jab, as they, as they try to call it. That was very common when I first started streaming, and I'm glad I kind of, like, you know, filtered that out. Because, like, that's a lot- that, that's, like, a big assumption when you go into a stream, that you can just, like, bully the streamer in a playful way. I hate that. I hate people that assume that's okay, too. Excellent. Okay. Well, that certainly lowered the defense points there. Perfect. Because at one point, people like people will think it's playful and just kind of go all in on it. And then it just turns into people just being mean-spirited. And it's like, Jesus, that's so rude. Especially when it happens to, like, smaller streamers that don't even know what's going on. Put the frickin' marshmallow down. Thank you! Thank you, she did that. All right. Oh, yeah, people went overboard. Excellent. Marshmallow, get flipped that over. Um, is that gonna... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. It, it's okay. They can't afford the toll for the next attack. Excellent. Well then, I basically win with this. No problem. Perfect. Mmm. Mmm. Alright, people also did that to you when you streamed. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Lorelai. People can be mean. You win. Excellent. Dude, you're pretty good. That was a nice win. I'm always up for another duel. Okay, we did it. We won that one. We are good teddies now. Oh yeah, like I'm reminded of this because like we started playing Banjo um, before this, right? When I tried to play Banjo years ago, I remember that stream was a bit of a mess because there were lots of people that, uh, that were, you know, doing the, the funny playful jabbing and also just trying to backseat despite me repeatedly being like, please stop doing that. <laughs> yeah. Excellent. Um, how about these two? A duel? That'll be fine. Hang on, yeah, let me get some water. Uh, 
Ugh. Much better. Water the streamer. Exactly. I think that's the, the thing where it's like when you're a new streamer, people are hesitant to tell to shut down any behavior because they think they might be overreacting. When in reality, no, you need to put your foot down if something's just like kind of like weird and annoying. Excellent. Oh, damn it. 50 points of damage. There we go. All right. She's throwing away a spell card to protect that defense maiden. Being playful over the internet can be weird, yeah. That reminds me of a weird email I got, like, years ago, right? I I've told this story before, but it's always a funny one. There was a time, like, someone tried to send me, like, uh, a softlock idea over Twitter, right? And they sent it in, like, the DMs. But the thing is, the way they worded their message was so cringy and rude. They would just say, like, ra saying random things like, this is gonna make you my bitch or something like that, if to give you an idea of how bad it was. It was. So, of course, just getting something like that, you know, and I've had enough of it. I just block the person because, like, you know, I don't get to put up with that. And that person got so pissed off about that, right? They were so upset that I would dare block them. And I think, like, I found out later that they would go on, like, Reddit, like, complaining that I treat my fans like crap or something. And it just makes you realize it's like, yeah, you, you don't want people like that in your fan base. Like, so good riddance. Ugh. Hang on. I might as well put this... No, wait, no. I can't beat over the damn rat. So we'll just put it in attack mode. Or, sorry, battle phase. Bruh, indeed, right? I know. Oh, I'm sorry. You can't swear at me. I'm, I'm sorry. That ruined the fan base, chat. I know some of you won't want to watch me after this. But it's weird. People are- people are just weird on the internet, that's how it goes. Especially in the early Yu-Gi-Oh! streams, too. <laughs> I tell you, we had to do a lot- go through a lot to make sure people were clear. They can't be weirdos here. Hang on. Alright, send out the toll. Mirror Force. We're only getting rid of one rat, though, that sucks. Excellent. Um, let me just set this. Light of Intervention is ruining everything. How much does this have? Who has the agreement for the monster? Duh. We could just win the burn, the burn, I suppose, and let this charge up. So let's do it. We're not allowed to be mean to you. I know, right? You, th you think that it wouldn't need to be put in the rules. But no. Pyramid Turtle. Excellent. Now you get burned. Come on, we almost have it charged up enough. It feels like you don't have to mod as much as you used to. Cringy people get filtered out by the vibe. Yeah. I guess I can mention this, because you actually showed me the messages the other day, Minerd. Um, wh what was it? I completely forgot about this until you showed me. But when I first started streaming, people were, were so weird I, that um, apparently in my first message to you, asking you to be a mod, I was showing that like people were like showing up and calling me like things like daddy, and it was like really cringy. <laughs> so I'm like, all right. That was the moment where I was like, yeah, I need- I probably should get some mods now. People are freaking weird. It's like, ugh. You win! Excellent. Completely forgot about that until you showed me the message. I almost didn't believe you until you showed me the screenshot. Whatever, I didn't even try. See you again. Nice going. Alright, we did it. Come on, child. I love how her, like, um, her portrait there looks like she's got some freaking muscle on her arms. <laughs> it's probably because they just reused the same arms from everyone else. Um, surging waves, limited fun. I don't, you know what? Why not? Let's, let's give it a shot. It's about to be time for class. All 
Perfect. First to go, second to go. Excellent. Obviously, they just misspelled Teddy horribly. <laughs> no, no, no. No, no, no. That is another reason I'm more comfortable with doing, like, uh, the VTuber thing for sure. Because not only is the vibe here just generally, generally better, like, I, I trust the mods to just kind of nip that stuff in the bud right away. And they do. Excellent. Um... Do I want to chain burn? Nah, this is fine. Okay, before anything else, we're gonna set the koala. We're gonna set this down here. Call mommy instead? No, 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 no. I'm sure there are. I'm sure there are plenty of VTubers out there though, where they probably will get that a lot of first-time chatters saying that. <laughs> that wouldn't shock me at all. Let me see. Poison mummy. Um, it's a quick play. I can flip it up as soon as I need to, I suppose. Let me do it. Okay, first, we're gonna let the burning land go off. And in response to that, we're gonna activate the secret barrel. And then I'm gonna activate the chain strike now. 1200. 1600. And 500 more. I love seeing all those things go off. Uh-oh. Oh, that sucks. Let me see. No need to look through their deck. I don't care what they got. I need to fix my seat. Frozen soul? Surely you can do something here, Blair. What is the maiden's attack power? It's 400, 300, huh? Those stats might as well be 0-0. Zero, zero. 500. Uh-oh. Well, that sucks. Oh, that's not good. Please, please. Okay. She got the maiden in love here. But she can't set up her thing. Hang on. Face up in the field. Did not strong result to battle. Um... Well, this is a problem, clearly. Do I let them attack into it just the one time? It should be fine. She has the equip in her hand, so we should be able to take it back from that. So I'll let it go. I hope. Ah, oh, damn it. Didi Assailant's gonna ruin it now. Okay, good. The effect doesn't go off. Thank you. Play it. Play it. Perfect. Now she's gonna flip up Solemn Wishes. We have the advantage. We can absolutely do this, probably. But we lost. <laughs> Just barely not enough. Oh, well. We tried our best. What can you expect? I'm much stronger than you. Great duel. We lost? Yeah, we did lose. What are you gonna do about it, Blair? I'm gonna go ahead and switch to the dungeon deck, and I guess we'll do that for a bit. How long have I been going? Damn, been almost three hours in here. Not bad. Made good progress today. We got to see Zane finally. I can- he's probably gonna appear as someone we can duel now. Yeah. Let's load the recipe. Chad, I'm starting to get hungry. Other hero burn? Yes. I'm gonna have myself some comfy dinner in a little bit, and then we're gonna enjoy the rest of my night. Well, I'm gonna enjoy the rest of my night. There we go. Atticus has already been roaming around for an eternity. Time for class. All right, I'm going. She's going to make me go anyway. Pretty sure. Will you watch the opening day event? No. Event.
visitor from the abyss. I'm on floor 55 and my record is 56. Let's do it. Enter the basement, everybody. All right. Yeah, that'll work. Oh, look at that. I leveled up again recently. I didn't even notice my max life points went up, went up there. Reinforcement of the army, yet again. Okay. No problem. No problem. Hmm. Put the fireballs down. What episode is this? I don't even know at this point. Maybe 27, 28. Could be a lot of them at this point. Yeah, we got this in the bag now. I just gotta put down Slicer, and that's game. Posture check, don't mind if I do. Get that sweet XP over here. Princess Karan. Karan? Karan? I don't know how you say it. All I know is... Hmm. That's the one you need Trial of the Princess for, and it's trash. Send out the Rime. Um, yeah. If they just play one monster, we basically got them. We're probably going to beat my record or immediately get killed here and get sent back to start, which would suck. Then we can go back to one-shotting people with sparks. That's that's a big problem. That's a big problem. Um, we can win, assuming there's no negates. I only lost 100 life points. It's whatever. We'll activate an effect here. Holy moly. Trap dust shoot. Eh, I already got a bunch of those. Alright, we're at the record floor, everybody. That's a lot of stuff right there. Let's get through it. The enemy! Gasp. You're getting to move first a bit more frequently lately. It's only sparks, but we can do it. Hmm. I don't even remember what I get for reaching floor 100 anymore. I just know it's a good way to kind of just get DP and XP. And a good way to just kind of like do something different for a little bit as well. No, you do not get the destiny draw. You get to lose, buddy. All of Duel Academy's skeletons are down there. Could they? Possibly. Got green gem. Elemental hero, the heat. Well, you're <laughs> we have all the heroes we'll ever need, so that's useless. Uh-oh. Only a few sparks now, huh? I want to say Koala will be enough here. We can just get it. Just Desserts as a little backup if they summon one. Stratos? What the hell are you playing Stratos for? Yeah, we win with this for sure. I guess... Wait, they do have an extra deck of 16 cards. Wow. Shocking. Also, damn, that's some big damage on them. No reward for that duel. Is that Jaden under the mask? Is everyone just, like, dressing up to, like... 
I don't know, like, for shits and giggles? I, I don't know what their pl game plan is here. This is ridiculous. We got two cards, and we got two just desserts. They're not going to be able to pay the cost, right? What do you stand by phase? Okay, but that's fine. Activate yet another spell card. No reason to even attack. Just hit him with this. Then we just gotta activate literally only one of the just desserts. No destiny draw for them. Enemy. Mm, okay. This one should be more than enough to win. Too bad I can't keep the life points I overheal. My max has to be capped at 42. You can't do that in Reshef for Destruction either, which is really silly. Because you have to manually heal your life points between duels, which is so dumb. Blast him for 1,200. All right. New record. I need some water. Okay. Wow, we don't even get to, to fight anyone this time. Nice. Boulder Tortoise. Boulder Tortoise. No, don't spoil what's at the end of the dungeon for me. Okay. Hmm. That'll do. They got just over, a little bit over 2,000 now. It's a decent amount of life points, I suppose. Eh, deal damage. We've got Poison of the Old Man if we need an emergency heal here. Throw down Burning Land as well. They attack into the Koala, it's basically game now. Goblin Thief? You can't- no, you can't do that. That's my plan, you jerk. Okay. Now I'm gonna take 500. I didn't expect it to go this far. Hard selling goblin. DNA surgery. Make everyone a fiend. Alright, that's great. So flip this up and we win. Oh, that was funny. 58. I haven't seen level 7 enemies yet. It could be right around the corner for all we know. There's just an endless... Yeah. Endless amount of crap down there. No, no, no. Toon Goblin uh, Attack Force isn't allowed to attack the turn it's summoned. A lot of Toon Monsters have that restriction. And we win exactly enough with this. Sick. Toon Goblin Attack Force is literally just, like, worst version of, of Goblin Attack Force. So a lot of uh, decks in this game just kind of have it as a weaker version, as a handicap, I guess. Old Toon Monsters are so silly. They're silly because they're Toons. It looks like I might have to take a little bit of teensy bit of burn damage here, yeah. Just to guarantee I get the win here, yeah, this- this'll be fine. Okay. 
This is fine. Only 60. Toon monsters weird me out because, like, it feels like they have to change the rules of them every time they print new ones. So a lot of them just have, like, a annoyingly inconsistent effects. <laughs> it's like, man. Alright. Let's do that. Didn't, like, Toon Dark Magician Girl have, like, one of the longest, like, texts printed on a card for a good while in the game? Until, like, Pendulums or something came out, right? No, that's probably didn't take that long. I've seen how wordy some of the Synchros and Xyz cards can be, too. Excellent. Yeah, that's good. That's good. I mean, yeah, video games can change the rules of their monsters every game, but um, in the case of a card game, like, you know, you're supposed to, like, the deck itself will still have the old effects. It's not like the old monsters are also updated, most of the time, anyway. Oh, I don't want to fight that much. How do I, how do I piss out of this? Hmm... No! I pressed down too early there. That's what I wanted. Alright, let's go. Either way, it's fine. Mystic Plasma Zone. Uh, uh, Kai Kyoku? Kai Kaiku? How do you say that? I actually don't know how you're supposed to pronounce that. Each time this card inflicts battle damage to your opponent, uh, life points, you can remove from play up to two monster cards in your opponent's graveyard. As long as the card remains face up on the field, your opponent can't remove from play any cards in either graveyard. Okay. Hi, cool. Is that how you say it? Hmm. Better use Tremendous Fire to play it safe so I can get out of here. I don't have much more fighting to do. This will be fine. I'm already kind of sick of the dungeon now. These guys are much, much tankier. It's becoming a pain in the ass to fight anything. And we win. Yeah, let's get rid of this guy. They're turning- they're, they're very much, like, not worth it anymore, it's starting to feel like. Alright. A lot of the low-powered spells, though, that's unfortunate. Oh. That sucks. Damn, wish I used, uh, Sparks first, then. I got a little too cocky there, too comfortable with playing the way I have been. Five hundred. Five hundred more. This isn't going to be enough. Oh, wait. Yes, it is. What, what am I saying? I... One step at... One step behind there with my mental math. Cannon Soldier doesn't look that sturdy of a machine. Can't believe this thing causes... Can make OTKs happen. It's supposed to be just a little, like, bumbling little monster. <laughs> Reinforcements. Let's get the hell out of here. Wait, that was the stairs. Oh, I I meant to get to the light. Oops. Oops. All right, let's just go past these two guys and get the hell out of here now. I swear I was trying to get out of here. Enraged battle ox. He's enraged, so he does piercing damage. Do we do we know in the Yu-Gi-Oh lore what enraged the battle ox? While we're at it, do we know what made the Celtic Guardian obnoxious? Answers I kind of want to know that I want to know about. You've got 1700, you can't beat over the koala. Hmm. This should be enough, I hope. Let's do it. 
the color red. No, no, he's an ox, not a bull. Do oxes don't hate the color the red too, do they? I don't actually know. I thought that was just a thing for bulls. That is a real thing, right? Or did cartoons lie to me for the past 20 years? Wouldn't be the first time. Bulls don't hate red. Then why do we why do we do that? Why do the matadors have like the the red cape? I thought that was why they had it. They attack rabid movement. That's what Oh, okay, that makes sense. Okay, we'll put this down. Put this down. It was assumed they hate red, but the cape's fluttering is what makes them mad. I can't believe Bugs Bunny would lie to me like that. Can I sue Warner Brothers for that? It's red because it's a blood sport. Oh, okay, so the cape is red to hide um, blood stains from injuries happening. Bugs Bunny lied about a lot. Yes, he did. What is his problem? Now get me out of here. We're on floor 60. Number of floors, okay. I got 41 XP for that. You're free to go. Bunnies don't even like carrots. He, he lied about that one too? Damn. They like bananas more. Ah. Okay, there's no event. So let's go down to the beach. I wonder if anything came in with the ocean. What does that mean? I mean, like, the tide bringing in seashells? I think that's what she means. Anyways, that dungeon session didn't really do too much. I think we're at the point where the dungeon's too slow to be worth it. I'll probably, like, do it a bit more sparingly in future episodes. As we- we're not- we're not at the point where we can just win stupid quickly anymore. Hang on, let's get Teddy Toll out. Yeah, exit deck edit. And cards just wash on the shore. Not seeing that happen. Dino Boy and Pierre. Sounds like a match made in hell. Merry-go-round. The storm. Ah, why not? Let's do it. What? You don't have an opponent to duel? You're the one who wanted the duel, so hurry up. Don't get any ideas. It's not like I approached you. What is her problem? The bulls actually enter the arena when they're already exhausted. They basically live a full life of luxury until they're sent to the arena, where they basically get tortured till the end. Oh. Oh, golly. So, bullfighting is just a lie. They actually just exhaust the hell out of the bull to make it look like they're stronger than they really are. Is that- hang on, is bullfighting, like, even still, like, legal? I never stopped to think about that. Those Looney Tunes cartoons with the Bugs Bunny doing that are actually quite old. Okay, we'll set down the koala. Set down the secret barrel. You know what? Let's go all in. You already used your heavy storm. Hmm. I can attack with you. It's a... Uh, okay, it's protected because it's like a cultural thing, I guess. All right. I guess that would explain why they'd be reluctant to get rid of it. New Doria. Uh. Hmm. Go ahead, do it. Send me to the graveyard instead. Thank you, Kyo, there for four months. I think it's still in Colombia and Mexico to an extent. All right. Well, this is a thing I know very little about, so it doesn't affect me. Oh my goodness, what is... Every time I say, ooh, they use their heavy storm, guess what the hell the next person's about to play? Rising air current. Premature burial. Oh boy, this is exciting. Get beamed. Only 800 on that one. Oh, this is a problem. 
Why would you set the marshmallow? Whatever. It's fine. It's fine. I guess it's fine. End the battle phase. Let's go again. Okay, we need to get this thing. No, it has four, four stars. Never mind. That won't work. Well, this is kind of a problem, isn't it? Guess I'll have to slow them down with this one instead. Dang, we can't really do much. Still happens in Portugal as well. Ah, okay. Or at least you think it does. Good enough. Penguin soldier. Let's go ahead and send you back. And let's go ahead and send this goddamn thing back too. Blair is not going to put the marshmallow down. The giant germs creature swap. Well, I guess it's a good thing you didn't put it down. Ooh, they just germed us. I can't believe we just got we just got germed. <laughs> what is it? the other one must be in her hand or something? Well, I suppose we could put down stealth bird. <laughs> No, we won't have- we need the advantage to get full- full effects of this. Yeah, I don't have the stuff to- I don't have any of my back row support. I just have my flip effects and this is really rough. At least I'm still burning. Plus 100! Set the marshmallow. And now we have Dark Ruler Hades. Hades nuts. Ah ha ha, Mao got him. No, they got me. We're dead. <laughs> oh, wait. No, chat. We have a chance. We have 50 life points. We're not going to be allowed to attack, but let's be real. Blair shouldn't be doing that. All right, here we go. Blair, I'm begging you, set the marshmallow. Please just set the goddamn marshmallow, please. Oh wait, no, we're dead. We can't win. <laughs> Never mind. I thought Ah, if only she had set the marshmallow. <laughs> Whatever. Whatever. She didn't want to set it. Meh. I got- I've got the gift. Too bad for you. I pity you. Come to me if you need an opponent. Try my best, Blair, okay? We could try these two. Why not? Marshmallow would have given enough burn to the opponent to stop them. But what do I know? I don't know anything, apparently. Chad, I feel my tummy rumbling. This is a problem that can only be solved by cookies. Or, you know, real food. I guess I'll have real food when I'm done streaming. Ooh, no monsters. This is bad. Your deck, I mean. <laughs> Effectively, you can just, like, negate one attack with that. Now, let me activate the fun stuff. I have no monsters either. <laughs> wow, we both got a rough start, huh? Okay, then. Hmm. Gonna have to save the chain burn for next time, then. No. Let's go for it, kids. First, we're gonna activate the secret barrel. Okay, no problem. Oh, that is kind of a big problem.
Chat, I think I might. I'm I'm about to die. Oh, I'm about to die. Not quite, but mm, I just got trunated. Sabersaurus is going for it. I almost thought Sabersaurus was that one Falsebound Kingdom dino, but that one's orange and it's called Mega Zowler, isn't it? Did she seriously just end on that? She didn't even put the javelin down? It wouldn't have helped, but, like, you know, the thought would have been appreciated. <laughs> oh, come on, man. Come on. That's Snipe Hunter, man. No, 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 we, we, we can't, like, we, we gotta go another one. We gotta go again. We gotta go again. No! <laughs> it didn't accept my input to move it da up and down. Now I'm dueling myself. I This is a favorable result, but we need to tag duel with Blair. Whatever. I'll just duel by myself against Hassleberry then. That's how I'll get our 10th victory. Then we can move on to someone else then. All right, we'll go ahead and set you. Go ahead and put this down. Put down the Teddy Toll. Chat, would you pay the Teddy Toll or would you try to skip out on paying it? I would hope you wouldn't skip it. That would be quite rude. Bear works a good job. Needs to get paid. 500. Take 300 more. Mm, okay. You can take the teddy. No, you can't. You can't just, like, take the teddy home with you. Even though that's literally what everyone does in, po in the Pokemon universe. But, uh, I say no. Burning lands. Uh, I can throw this down. I may as well. If you skip it, well, then you get banned. If you can't pay the toll, you can't watch the stream either. 500. At least the effects are going off. Nice. Give Teddy Cleffa cookies? How could you? How could you? Oh. Dark Triceratops. Oh, he's going for the pierce. Oh, we got that. We got this. This is okay. This is okay. Oh, I basically win with this. Nice. <laughs> no, 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 no. Okay. That's fine. That destiny draw will not help you as we win with the foam darts. I should really look up what the Japanese artwork of that card looks like. I'm kind of curious what the gun is actually supposed to be colored like. I lost, but you can't keep a soldier down. Nice. Okay. That covers that. Can I buy anything? Let me buy some sandwiches, see if she can, like, just, like, like me a little bit better. You come here to buy a sandwich? Why do you look so disappointed? I'd be careful. Eating only sandwiches isn't good for you. I didn't ask for your approval. Now, you're going to sit there and eat 20 of these until we're friends. Okay. Called me out. Who does she think she is? Spicy fish eggs? Oh, I love this. Thanks. You don't tell me what I can and can't eat. Sweet bean paste. Okay, she enjoyed that one too. Let's see a card. 
White Veil, Dark Master Zork, and Elemental Hero Wild Edge. This is pretty good. Oh, hang on. You got a picture of it? I'm not going to show it on screen, but I'll look at it. No, that's not it. That's not it, is it? Fire darts? That's a completely different artwork. Did they just draw a completely new thing for Secret Barrel? I don't know. Anyways. Tofu sandwich. Does she like tofu? She seems easy to please. She's like, you shouldn't eat only sandwiches, and she proceeds to eat all the sandwiches I get. Oh, I see gold. Easy. Yay. All right, perfect. Easy free event now. May as well do that. I wonder if Jaden's here. Girl, calm down. How long you plan on being out? You're gonna get in trouble. I'm headed home. You better go to bed, too. You don't tell me what to do. Morning. Come on, early bird gets the worm. If you're ready, let's hit the road and duel. Alright, let's do the first generic event, which should be Dark Magician Girl, right? Yeah. Oh, man, come on. You're so lucky. Alright. Alright. This is the same event that we've seen 15 quadrillion times. Dark Magician Girl, good luck. Here we go. Alright, let's go for it. First to go, second to go. It's time to duel, everybody. All right, so even the Japanese version of this card has, like, the, uh, the foam dart-looking gun. Is it supposed to look like a toy, then? The only thing they changed is that there was a Japanese- there's a Japanese symbol on the- on the, uh, the gun they airbrushed out. All right. That's weird. Usually it's just a- just straight up is a gun. Or maybe they just preemptively did it because they knew they were going to change it later anyway. I don't know. Anyways, let's do this. Symbols in the international version, too. Okay, so I guess they just didn't care. I don't know. Our whole hand is going in. Nope, no problem. Alright, we'll end right here. She's about to take a whole bunch of chunky damage. Let me see. Maybe the secret is that it's harmless, but it's actually a real weapon. Possibly. Okay, what we can do now is we're going to put down Stealth Bird, and then I'm going to go ahead and flip up Morphing Jar, and just for free, fill up my entire thing. Yeah, that's great. I'll put down a Dark Room of Nightmare, because of course I can. And just because, we may as well attack with the Morphing Jar for an extra 700. I think she bricked again. She hasn't been able to do anything. Go for it. Go on, go for it. 500, and then 300 more from this. I'm shocked that they apparently changed that. Because I know re I've recently learned there was like, um... There's a Blackwing Synchro Monster, right? And, and he's holding some kind of like harpoon gun. And in the North American release, they, they also like edited it edited the card to have, like, you know, the blue, orange, green colors on it. 
So I just assumed Secret Barrel was supposed to also just be like straight up guns that they just edited to foam dart guns or something. Okay, we basically win with this turn, don't we? Dark Magician Girl always bricks. She's not very good. Her deck sucks. <laughs> She's not very good at all. Oopsie, hang on. Cursor defaulted this. Hell yeah. That was easy. 518. We're getting a ton of points now, too. That was a sweet duel, everybody. I feel like 9 times out of 10 with dueling this girl, she's bricked like, um, she's not bricked like maybe once or twice. <laughs> I've beaten her with like the Sparks deck multiple times, too. Ouchie. Oh, may as well do this for some extra points. Oh, it's Jim and Axel. I don't like fighting Jim because his, like, flip effects always mess up mine. Because his are better. Draw. Chat, my tummy is rumbling even more. I should wrap this up soon. There we go. I should wrap this up soon so I can make some dinner. No, you can't post links in chat there, friend. Only mods can do that. All right. Solemn Wishes, Enchanted Javelin. Canyon. Oh, yeah. Look at that bloom effect. Looks like a, a faraway shot in Twilight Princess. Eh, we don't need to activate that. Okay, it's my turn. I'll go ahead and put this down. I'll go ahead and put this down. Um, We'll put down chain energy. Oh, wait, no, I should have did that last. I'm sorry. Now I got to pay an extra 500. Silly me. And now we hope that Jim doesn't mess us up. Come on, Axley, you can do it. 500. Blaze Accelerator, you scum. Try Blaze Accelerator. Medusa Worm. There it goes. He's doing the Volcanic Slicer. Mm. Let that one attack. This is fine. And now when this one attacks, he's going to pay the 500. And we're going to go ahead and activate Magic Cylinder. A little bit of a later day. Yeah, I did stream a long time today. It was like three and a half to four hours of Banjo before this. And I wanted to just get some Yu-Gi-Oh! recorded to make sure I got a lot on hand. Okay. Not planning to go like uh, eight hours next stream, chat. Tuesday is usually a short day anyway. Okay, fossil fused. Angry mod noises. Don't ca calm down. Everything's fine. Uh oh, here they come. Now we don't really. Mm, we can basically just negate the uh, the strongest one. Okay, good. She activated it. We almost got this. They're not going to be able to make any more attacks. After this one. We just got to burn them for a tiny amount of damage and that's game. Okay. Just set this. And I suppose I may as well just set ch Chain Strike and prompt it with literally anything. They can't attack, we win, we get points. Yep, yeah, there we go. Like that, for example. Say goodbye to their last 200.
694. Yeah, that's a lot of freaking points. Bravo! Good stuff, Asprey. But Shirley here seems awfully happy. He's getting out of here. All right. Now let me just go somewhere and save. I think it's a good stopping point. Yeah, it's it's getting it's getting late. Usually I start with Yu-Gi-Oh on Sundays, but this is okay. Streamer is hungry. I don't want to get I don't want to be hangry playing Yu-Gi-Oh. So we'll go ahead and make a save here. Overwrite your data. Yes, I will. Save completed. Do it again just in case. It's starting to thunder where you are. Ooh, cozy storm night. No, pl not planning the stream tomorrow. I'm gonna see, make sure I rest well, go to the gym, and then do another stream on Tuesday. I got editing to do tomorrow anyway. Anyways, I hope you guys had a fun time. This was a nice little long stream. Always nice to get some more Yu-Gi-Oh recorded. We're making more progress. Ugh, but for now, have a good night, everybody, and bye bye